Ay, qué cursi. My Grito Podcast Network presents. Oh, la mera neta, ¿no? Oh, no. <laughs> hey there, Shufflers. Here to talk to you about Manscape. As you all know, Cinco de Mayo just passed, and some of you went out and celebrated. Hopefully, you got to show off El Bandolero. But now, Mother's Day is coming, time to make your mom proud, or the mother of your children. What better gift than the fresh trim with a box of chocolates, some flowers, and a nice gift? Then go get yourself the performance package. You'll get the lawnmower 4.0, the weed whacker, para las orejas y para la nariz, the anti-chafing deodorant, a soothing aloe ball spray, a travel bag, and some moisture wick under chonies. But wait, if you already cleaned up El Campeón, why not fix your mascara's beard, right? Manscaped has the answer for you, the Beer Hedger by Manscaped. The Beer Hedger comes with a built-in adjustment settings. It's waterproof, and with a clean and fresh beard, you're setting it up for the grand finale. El Campeón. Are you suggesting that you buy yourself a gift for, for Mother's Day? Well, it's a gift that keeps on giving. So you get yourself the gift, but it's really for her. This is one of those where it's really uh, for her. For your mom? Well, I, I mean, to make your mom proud. Ah, okay. Pero que vas a llegar y dice, ma, me rasuré. Ah, parece... Todavía como cuando te traje del hospital. Just like the day I brought you back from the hospital. Yeah, but no... Uh, you know, it's it's one of those gifts that you get to give. Ya viene el calor. Ya so viene. so you, you still give the flowers, but you also give, you give the chocolates, the uh, flowers, and andale. All right, I got yeah. it. I got it now. Yeah, yeah. you give the flowers para desflorear. Oh so shit! All right, all right. So compas, this Mother's Day, be that vato de tallista. Be that vato that picks out the best chocolate and flowers. Be the groom vato. Then order yourself the performance package and the beer hedger. Head on over to Manscape. Trust us. Your pubes will thank you. Your jefita will thank you. And your mija will thank you. And you might even get to show it off to a, a new mamacita. Oh, I don't know, please. All right. Wait, so, but what if you already have a... Uh, all right, I'm just saying. No, 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 no because maybe <laughs> maybe they don't have a, a mom. You know, maybe... Oh, if you don't have... Yeah, yeah maybe they don't have a mom. Way. Maybe they don't Asterisk, have... Asterisk, uh, you know? Yeah, maybe they don't have a mom. mom. Disclaimers. Maybe they don't have a wife. Because you, you made it sound like you're going to... Que pa' tu mamá, pa' tu esposa, oh, y pa' no. tu mistress. Ah, yeah. Oh, yeah. El, yeah. el que tiene hambre pa' piensa, Fanny. You go yeah. starting problems, Ramon. No, 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 I'm just saying. It's just like, you know, make your mom proud. Make your, your mija proud. But if you don't have either one, then make the mamacita proud. Yeah. Hola, right. hola, fichera, la que caiga. Hola, que caiga. All right. <laughs> Get to spread that lover's pot. There see? you go. <laughs> hey, but you're saying like your pubes will thank you. But yeah. Your pubes are gone. Well, the, so los que, los que, no, los, no, because yeah, you took some weight off of them. Ah, I see, I see. You know, because they're not completely gone. They're still, I mean, we want to get to the science of it. No. All right. Mm. All right. So. Get 20% off free shipping with the code Chicano Shuffle, one word, at manscaped.com. That's right. You get 20% off with free shipping at manscaped.com. Use the promo code Chicano Shuffle. Unlock your confidence and always use the right tools for the job with Manscaped. Oh, Bam! Shit. And while you're at it, ways, you can buy some flores, the Manscaped package. 
In a little camisa from a House little, of Chingazos yeah. for your fucking... Yeah, there's there's for some... For your moms. Yeah, they got some nice little camisitas for the mijas and la jefita. Yeah, you know? Fuck yeah. 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 Sometimes I hear people saying like, well, she's not my mom. I'm like, dude, she's the mother of your children. Ah, when it... Okay, okay. Pero que tal si no se llevan bien, hombre. De todos modos, you don't take away that. <laughs> ¿Eso qué tiene que ver con las camisas? No, no, no. <laughs> Compren una camisa. <laughs> this took a turn. Hold on. No, this is like, you know, because some people be like, ah, why, why am I going to do all this? Ah, I see, I see. Well, no, she's... <laughs> Ramón <laughs> needs disclaimers all, all over the place. <laughs> está, está desvelado, está desvelado. Ah, sí, es cierto. Está desvelado. Está más allá que acá. You could always, you know, una camisita does, you know, does speak volumes. Uh -huh. yeah, yeah. Nice little gift, wife. Yeah. Yeah. You know, and if you. ¿Todavía llega? ¿Cuándo es el día de las madres? ¿Es weekend? El, bueno, para, lo, para yeah, la raza es el 10 el de, de mayo. mayo. Wednesday. Yeah. So. Oh, so maybe you don't got time. Para el otro Sunday, ¿no? Yeah, for next. Yeah. Uh, what is it? 10 and 12. Ah, you, you can keep it going know. another yeah. week. You could. As long as it's post dated, you can say, look, it's I got it right here. Lo ordené antes de tiempo. You know, so. Bam, you're, yeah. you're, you're covered. You're covered. You, you show receipts, eh? Yeah. Promo code Chicano Shuffle. Yeah, that's right. Links in the bio. Yeah. Now, let's just say que te fue bien con la pinche rasurada, te fue bien con la camisita, las flores y los chocolates y un regalito que por ahí. Why not make it extra special for the next day con un cafecito de estaza? Oh, you know? and the new mug that you got your mama. Oh, there you go. Yes. You could also get a mug from ChicanoShuffle.com. Oh, oh, that's true. You know, we got, right, right. We got si mugs. Si quieren. Si no. But yeah, but you know, you could just, you'll be that, you'll be that considerate or that thought. ¿Cómo se dice? Thoughtful. Thoughtful bato. Yeah, I'm fucking off today, bro. Yeah, you're off. I am off. So, let's get started, eh? All right, so. Ding, 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 ding. A, hasta la próxima. Al rato se está eh? yeah, No out. stories? What the? F nothing to interrupt? No. Well, yeah, yeah, Franny, yeah, me voy. Yeah, no, Ellie already burned all the material. I know. Right? During what? technical difficulties. She went, <laughs> she went through all the fucking. All the noticias. All what? The, oh, the cheese man, my vecinario. So, yeah. so you guys yeah. went around for, the, for that part, yeah. I was just telling them that, you know, people in my building are having affairs and. They, one lives across, the lady that lives across from me and the man that lives downstairs are having an affair. From her? Downstairs from her, downstairs from you. The man lives downstairs from me and the lady lives across. So let me let me guess. Oh, by the way, welcome to the shuffle. Hey. Oh, yeah, welcome to the Chicano shuffle. Hey. Once again, I'm here for Esteban porque pues está ahorita de gira. Anda de gira, anda de, de famoso. Déjalo, right. déjenme a mi amigo. No, nobody say, nobody's saying anything wrong. Oh, you think you're being condescending? No, I'm sure. I'll be like, ah, or under the no. famoso. No, 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 Ember. Uh, it's the, the, the Mind Buzz podcast. Uh, they set up um some like open mic. Mm -hmm. at, and uh, what is it? Is it Bellflower for you? Yeah. I want to say it's Bellflower. Bellflower yes. or Chateria mm -hmm. RL. So they have it like think, once a month. So I'm like, oh, maybe I should go up with my. You but know. but you do know, okay, it's open mic for everybody. So there will be a lot of other people talking, not just you. Oh, wait. So you, wait, you didn't want to do poetry because we we're talking about this before. But I <laughs> no. thought it was a joke. <laughs> I mean, I got, I got thoughts. I got, <laughs> I, I got opinions. I got thoughts, Bernie. I got oh, thoughts. I, I thought Bernie. you guys were fucking wrong. But, uh, <laughs> all right, yeah. Dale, güey. Let's do it. Dale, guys. You tried, you tried anyway, the comedian yeah. thing and no te pasó. Nah. Oh, but I mean, I could talk. Oh, let's see. No, the comedian thing is just, I was, I was pedo and I fucked it up and then como que no ayudó. And it's, you know what? It's not for me. Ya, hombre, ya, hombre, ya lo pasado, pasado, hombre. It's not for me. But back to your cheese man. Oh, no, my cheese man is that my neighbors are having an affair. And... So, so the lady across from you, uh, uh, Connor uh, Cross. Yes. And then the, the, the Dude, tenant I'm, below I'm, you. Mm -hmm. So let me ask you, do you like lay down con la oreja en el piso no, to try to hear what's going no, on? No, no, no. No, it's not that like that. No way. If he's in the bottom of me, like. I oh, he's on the, the bottom, bottom of you. Holy oh, shit. Oh, my God. He lives in the fucking <laughs> apartment below mine. Uh huh. Está la, la, el piso y there's a lot of layers. I can't hear all that. You can hear a lot of shit. <laughs> no, el que sí oigo is the one next to me. Oh. Ese sí era. Ese sí es was, it, was he like doing only fans or something? I think so. I think I told him, no. What yeah. the fuck? Yes, yeah, my neighbor. Next that, to her. The, there's my apartment and the middle one and the third one. The guy in the middle is the, when he first moved in, 
tenía su perrito, ya, o oh, sí lo caminaba, but then the doggy passed away, and I think part of his grievance was se desembuchó. But he would have, he would have all kinds of wild parties. And my neighbors on the other side would tell me that they would hear stuff, and girls, and they're the ones like, hey, I think he's filming stuff, because the way that they're talking, he's like directing I want to have a party, you know, a yeah, big party. Man. <laughs> <laughs> y pues yo me enojaba, because no me invitaban, you know, uh, forget right. the noise, I don't all care. Right. But oh, no, he shit. was, the, the guy in the middle, he was really, like, he would have parties, and and he would have people, people. yeah, yeah, like, when, at one point I heard, I'm not gonna lie, I heard, like, four male voices and one female, I'm like, yeah, that doesn't sound like it's gonna be... That sounds, oh, shit. Yeah, no. that sounds like uh, the carpool. But it's yeah, That's my a neighbor, different kind of carpool karaoke. Is, yeah. My neighborhood is full of stories. What is that? Two in the front and three in the back? Or something right like way. That? Two in the pinky, one in the stinky? Something like no, that. No, well, yeah. they said carpool. Is yeah, that that's, a, that's, a, that's the term, like the sexual term. It's called the carpool. Right oh, my. what the fuck? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. That's yeah. what? some new generation Two stuff? in the front and three in the back, I think it is. Isn't it like just busting the train? That's what I remember. Uh, I mean, yeah, but they, they, they've gotten so creative. That's the metro? <laughs> no, no, like, <laughs> that's the metro. You pack them all in. Oh, <laughs> Anyways, it's all derogatory oh, terms. Shit. But <laughs> stay away. <laughs> oh my god oh my throat hurts Pero este, yeah, yeah, no. I heard they want to make it free too yeah. <laughs> no. get some extra security because some people get out of hand no. pues sí, ahí, pues okay no. so so this lady alright so, so como está el co how did you I mean what are the telltale signs that you think that they're having an affair because <laughs> she's married eh? okay pero y el vecino I, de abajo is he married? No, ya eh, estaba casado antes, pero es un señor ya grande. Like, he's probably like 50, 55. Okay, Andres has, Garcia type. Andres Garcia, for sure. Yeah, Andres uh, Garcia type. Alto. Like I would, too. Luego, I, I should even I crushed on him one time. I'm like, eh, daddy. Oh. I would. Pero este, ¿Tiene terrenos? Pues tiene, I don't know. I don't know. I can only hope. No me hice amiga de él. No me hice, I don't talk to a lot of people. In my, I don't talk to people in my hood. Right. In my, in my, in my building. You're not social in the building. No, I only talk to like the couple two doors down from me. Mm hmm Oh, yeah. hold on. Before I forget, by the way, we're we're uh, filming from the oh. Rancho Los Amigos Old Abandoned Asylum. The old, oh, the old Ranchos Amigos, because yeah. yeah. the new one, no? Que yeah. salen los fantasmas. <laughs> I know, so whatever you guys see in the background, that's yeah. that's the uh, yeah. old asylum. Mira, yeah, throw the, some signs, because Ramon's going to fucking... So you know. the, the telltale signs are, she started moving his cars <laughs> in the parking <laughs> lot. She was moving his <laughs> cars. Ah, cabrón. And then she was driving his truck. And I see this in the morning when I leave to work, like, because I go to work like a few days of the week. The other is I work at home and I'm just like, OK. And then one time she took her kid to school in his, the, like, troca el señor. Now, mind you, these, this lady has her husband. Pero okay. I don't know about all this stuff. Pero lo que, lo que yo he visto es que she moves his cars and then two or three times I've been getting home. I arrive home and I know that's his truck. Y se estaciona él y yo me estaciono. And then they both come out. From the truck. Yeah. Oh, and shit. I'm just like yeah, they, no, no, they, no, no. they move the truck together yeah, I'm like but a different kind of movement no yo nomás like I, I, I'm like I'm none of my business I'm just using my head down whatever. none of my business but no cierra la cortina no. <laughs> <laughs> I don't do that I, I heard, like I brother heard like sister no, I heard there's, a, there's a, a a text thread going on they're not text thread it's <laughs> a group chat it's not a, group a chat. it's not a group chat she comes over like hey girl did you, did oh you? your neighbor your yeah, other neighbor my, my other neighbor Es una girl chavalilla con sus hijos y su esposo. You know, we take care of each other. Like, hey, girl, I got some vegetables. Get it. No, Kylie. Hey, girl, he said to comer. You know, they're good people because sometimes llego cansada y no quiero hacer nada. And then, hey, girl, I got some food. Fuck it. All right. So ella es la que me dice because she's more, you uh, know, yeah. aware Más and everything. Más involucrada. And she's the one that told us, hey, I think our neighbors are having an affair. And I'm like, yeah, like, I think so too. Pero... The uh, uh, just a curious minds want to know. Yeah, when, and I'm just like when, when you're staring out the window through las cortinas, apagas la luz in the room. Yo no estoy en las ventanas. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not Ramon. <laughs> That's a good one. <laughs> just saying. Yo apagaba you're... la luz, but Fernie Cowie would give me away. No, no. <laughs> well, like, why is it so dark in here? Click. <laughs> ah. No. Es que sabes que after like right there in my building after seven o'clock everybody's indoors. 
you know and the good thing with me is that i get to pull you yeah but it's always just the kids they're never like any Good adults cheese, doing crazy shit all right antes probably like three years ago there was a family kid uh, they would have parties and they have this and i don't care they took advantage of the pool they did and i'm like whatever cada quien. Mm-hmm. i mean no me molestaba. i'm like no nah, i don't care but yeah so there's a lot of shit going on in my building i mind my business though i don't I open the windows and I make sure that my light is on. They see me like, yeah, but no lo hago tanto. All right. Nah, fuck, I don't care. I pay my rent, mind my business. Just don't come knocking on my door asking if there's a man here. Oh, right. <laughs> yeah, you told us about that one. That guy yeah. got, ended up getting arrested, no? Uh huh. He oh, ended up getting arrested because ese mismo loco le echó los perros a otra neighbor. She fucking told her brother. Y pues ahí se armó. Yeah, so el psycho. Se armó la trifulca. Yeah, se armó la trifulcada. So then the this crazy one, is there a man here? He went crazy one night. He busted the truck of the, de la, o sea, hubo un desmadre. He busted the truck and mirrors and all this shit and they arrested him and he's no longer there. No shit. Yeah. But 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 I was the one judge because I was like, why the fuck are you coming to my house at this time asking if there's a man here? Mm. Hey, but like you said, we're, this month is Mental Health Awareness Month. You said, <laughs> <laughs> so it's a good story to bring up. <laughs> that's true. May is Mental Health Awareness Month. And that's so why what we're do we right need to be aware of at the old asylum. Yeah. Old oh, asylum. Si cierto. Oh shit, I didn't even yeah. think about it. This all ties in no, together. Les, yeah, no, let's like, hey, let's let's go over here. Vamos let's go to the old asylum. Mental I don't want to drive that far. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Let's hang out in my hood. Yeah. Okay, okay. But the, the thing is that we needed two requirements. One, we needed electricity, and two, we needed a Wi-Fi connection. Mm-hmm. So okay. you ended up getting that for us. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. We'll go see the ghosts. No, do, you, fuck that. Do, do you think Rasa knows about mental health awareness? Porque Rasa doesn't really. I don't know. Yeah. We just say that pinches chiquillos chiqueados. Pinche viejo loco, pinche vieja tóxica. Yeah. Pinches gordos, pinches, flacos. Pinches viejillos, anticuados. Se te fue el tren. Yeah. I mean, there's a lot of layers to it. A lot. This fucking onion. Machine it's a lot hair. because... I know, I know that... Estás deprimida, ponte a hacer algo. Yeah. <laughs> ah, estás triste. Ah, ah ahorita, ahorita vamos a, a alegrarte Or, la vida. Yeah. A ver, ahorita ponte, te voy a dar algo para que estés triste, cabrón. Eh. Ponte mm-hmm. a cortar el sacate, cabrón. Yeah. No. Ah, sí. A ver, o, o también y no... <laughs> Tú encomiéndate a Dios, mija, y él cura todo. Oh, shit. <laughs> Do you remember when I was like, what, 13, 14, maybe 15? Okay. I had a girlfriend and they were like, you know, we would break up and you start all sad and shit. <laughs> listening to fucking. Oh, what's it? I'm your puppet. <laughs> 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 I know. Mama, el ramo está triste. Dígale que haga algo. I fucking hey, loved her. Did my parents know you? Tenías, que tú tenías noviecitas o qué? I don't know. I, I did show up. Remember that one time with a hickey or so? My mom was like, yes, o qué es? You did? Yeah. Yo no me acuerdo. Yeah, but. <gasps> slut. No, wow. <laughs> but, but He's so, for the streets. I know that Rondon is the, how is it, the handball courts? Oh, yeah, the handball courts. Uh, yeah, well, that was a good spot. Uh, yeah. Well, that's where he learned the, the hand gesture, oh, yeah. the movement. I, you know, <laughs> <laughs> you know that, that, yeah, Ramon. the little swift, little swift action to the top I, to I ace it. Well, the, the perfect yeah, tap. Ramon. Yeah. Oh, shit. Uh, but no, yeah. But I've been enamorado. Otro Jerky, man. Jerky's been enamorado? Well, his dead boy have had girlfriends in the kindergarten. Yeah. He's been in a relationship since then. I think that's how we get along. I think so. You guys like, are both very, yeah. like, you wear your heart on your sleeve. You know? You're yeah. bad as it. You're bad. <laughs> shit. shit. <laughs> <laughs> Pinch yeah. of breaking hearts everywhere. No, no. I, I got my heart broken. Yeah? Oh, yeah. What? How old were you when you had your first heartbreak? Hey, teacher, five, teachers don't count. Five years oh, yeah. old. Five years five old? Years yeah, we How were the fuck? five years old. Uh, La Chiquilla. So remember, I don't I don't think you remember because I was in kindergarten and you were like one year old. Yeah. But my mom, <laughs> my mom, se hizo amiga de una señora que vivía en la esquina en unos apartamentos que tenía una niña that was in my class, right? So sometimes my mom would walk us, sometimes her mom would walk okay. us. Right. Or they would both walk us to school and then they would go to the park and run. Mm-hmm. Las dos señoras. And we were in class. So I, I was in love with her because it used to make us hold hands. Oh, shit. Like, you know, you know, uh-huh. oh, fuck yeah. Hey? I mean, that's fuck, what that, that's what he lived for. Banque, and then, you know? and and that, and that's why you shouldn't let the kids hold hands. Like so, that. so, so, yeah, yeah I see. And then at some point, like in the middle of kindergarten, they moved out. <gasps> 
And I never saw her again. Oh. I remember her name. Veronica. But I was avanzado then, because I don't... Yeah. I think for the most part, little kids don't think. I was I was really sad. I remember being really sad and they know así como you know cuando la la canción la 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 de la mochila su. But, oh, I, but I'm not saying was it you, 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 you still going? Yeah, still because she used to have little sad eyes. I used to oh my like, oh pobrecita. I mean, when you're five though, I'm saying like, did, were you was it heartbreak or was it just you you lost your little friend? And no, like, I think it was heartbreak because. Um, I, I, we really hung, we used to hang out a lot during kindergarten. We sat next to each other and, um, after school we didn't hang out or play. So it was just, I always look forward like the walks and, and class. But heartbreak isn't always about love, like romantic. Love. I know, but that's what we started as, yeah. no? like pinch amor, heartbreak, like yeah. from love, like from ¿Y que te dijo? or something. <laughs> And you're Ramon five. Turns you're... to five years old. Fucking. <laughs> 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 yeah, fucking. He's like, I was pimping at five. Eh? Making, nah, making, not pimping. Making but... heart shapes out of his slices of cheese. No, con la manita. Ramon, comete ese pinche queso. Los <laughs> 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 haciendo corazones. Que no es gratis. Que no me lo dio el gobierno. Tú cállate, pinche. Estos problemas de adultos. Que yo no me lo traje. Que no me lo traje del parque. No. Do you remember... Physically, what your body felt? Yeah, once the, my mom told me that they moved out and cannot, you know, you know, start, I'm like, I got really fucking sad. <coughs> Don't okay. bullshit me. No, I'm not. I'm not bullshitting you, bro. We know you got sad. Yeah. Physically, I don't te, know. Te dolía el estómago. Yeah. Te sentías así. No querías comer. Yeah, parecía, parecía you pájaro that, baleado. You felt that feeling. I know a lot of people have like. Esa sensación de que aquí, like, yeah. oh, fuck. Oh, fuck, yeah. That yeah. kick in the stomach feeling? Mm -hmm. At five? At five. Yeah, the, and then uh, in that's... fifth grade, another Veronica. Hija, that's a bitch Veronica. Yeah, another Veronica. So, V names. Yeah. yeah. So, she she came in, she because uh, I think she was in a, I think she moved into the neighborhood. So, at fifth grade, she came in, and right away, you know, I was a funny guy. She came to me, we were Ay, talking, hola, hola. blah, blah, blah. No, and then, uh, <laughs> Muy chistosito. And the funny guy. We would hold hands. I remember we would hold hands. He learned at five. Yeah. yeah. That's what you do. And then, uh, what you call it? And then um, about a month later, llega otro chiquillo. And I remember his name. Se llamaba Hugo. Oh, And Hugo. when he walked in, he was wearing like a blue shirt what, with the Rambo. Guy? With the Rambo fucking. Oh, oh shit. But that's a chistosito. That's yeah, a tough guy. Eh? But that's the way it up. You know, like, dude, he had a Rambo shirt. Yeah, you Can't know, first blood, first blood Rambo con la pinche matralleta and right the bandana way. and everything. And I'm all like, fuck. And then right away, so yeah. he came in. Dijiste, you will know. And the thing is, like, <laughs> 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 episode of The Simpsons, when Bart gets his heart broken, you won't be needing this. <laughs> oh. Yeah, so then she but he started holding hands with him. Ah, oh, in front of you, or sad? Yeah, oh yeah, yeah. My no, life. But literally it walked up and un titere, un titere, <laughs> un titere. <laughs> Fuck, the, nah, that one was really heartbreaking. E, okay, and, and that one, I was sad. Time. I was really sad. I think I might have cried. Okay. I think I might have cried because I'm like, ¿Por qué? pero, <laughs> <laughs> ¿por qué? Dios mío, no somos nada. Did you like, con esas y así conectas y todo, like? Did, would you tell my mom like no, I'm not a no, no. Y mama no. te preguntaba? No. No, no, they don't they, you know, they don't know that. <laughs> they don't know that. And Ay, then, mi hijo, yeah. mi hijo con su buen corazoncito. Yeah, and then, uh, <laughs> know, bien Siempre bien sensible. My mom would always say you were more sensible. Yeah. Dice, my mom told me when she said, "Oh, con tu hermano cuando nació, like very like Like, bien, bien tiernito, mi niño, bien uh. así. Las, pero cuando tú naciste, <laughs> parecía que estaban matando a alguien. I'm like, Una pinche chiva. I'm like, oh, what's shit. your point, Meche? You just <laughs> loud. What is your point? Yeah. So, no, that one that one was like the second one. And then, yeah, this place was in junior high. Oh, shit, we're just at the second one. Oh, yeah. my God. Junior, no, no, I'm not going to go through all of them. There's no, so no. many. We started I think you, five, you, 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 you and Jerry can a, a list of like yeah. más novias, at what age, who had the hardest heartbreak. Yeah. I think we, know? Need, we need a, a sponsorship from Better Help. Porque... <laughs> <laughs> we I, do. Yeah. So, eso and tu, y tú, Fernie? You, you okay? I, don't, I don't remember no? from five. Fuck no. No, 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 no your first general, heartbreak. Your first heartbreak. Well, I don't. <sighs> he went to an all boys school. You have no feelings? <laughs> oh. <laughs> Ah, me, me rompió el corazón ese la cabrón. monjita <laughs> y las puntadas la monjita ese cabrón ese cabrón <laughs> you did go to all boys high school oh, high, high school, school. All right, el so, pinche pero no no I mean elementary you remember. had crushes 
Yeah, we of course I had crushes, but I remember having fucking heartbreak. Mm-hmm. Moises, Moises, like the word, like like Noelia described that heartbreak. I don't remember having that until. I mean, I'm referring it to his heartbreak until like high that school. That feeling of like. Ugh. Yeah, like yeah. until like uh, I don't remember that until like high school. Como Ralphie. Yes, yeah, okay. Like, there wasn't even like like someone. Como dice, it was kind of like he's saying, like you know what? Maybe like a girl was that I, I dated for for like a month, you know. Mm-hmm. But it seems like forever when you're uh, when you're like serious. a <laughs> when a you're in high school serious, yeah. when you're a freshman or a sophomore. <clears> okay, <throat> you know, like a month. You're like, oh shit, I wait. Okay, it's a serio. Ya ya estás hasta planeando de qué vas a trabajar, de qué la vas a mantener. I gave you the best years of my life. Yeah, like that. But mm-hmm. I, that's some time I remember, like like some some something like that. I don't know if that that's serio como dices, pero. Get like for a few days or a week. No, no, no. How like, does she break your heart? Does she br- dump you? Does she go to somebody else? Or no, a well, pinchi. In aquel entonces, como dices, way it was on all boys school and high school way. So fucking choosing a completely other school way. So I don't, I don't know. She just stopped talking to me. Way she <laughs> ghosted, ghosted you. Yeah, she, she she ghosted me in those times where he called her house. Y la mamá te decía que no estaba. Oh, no está. Oh, mamá, dile que no estoy. No, no, no está. Si si habla si habla el Fernando ma, dígale que. Me fui a México de vacaciones. <laughs> Estamos en septiembre. <laughs> <laughs> you just started school. I know. Yeah. So, yeah. But, so I, but I don't remember it as hard as you're saying. Where, oh, no, yeah, like no, the, yeah. the, the, the hard ones, the hard heartbreaks were, were later. We're like probably mm-hmm. towards the end of high school, maybe only after, after 17, let's say. <laughs> and the, the second Veronica, I'm like, ¿Y quién es él? <laughs> <laughs> ¿En qué lugar se enamoró de ti? Rambo. <laughs> Chica, <laughs> it's era bien enamorado. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I well, I, I, you know what? No, I'm not going to blame my mom. I'm going to thank my mom because she listened to a lot of that music. Oh. You know? So she would put a lot of that music on. I know, but, 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 that no, because it was so bonito el amor. Like they said, I don't think that's what it was because, like, no, they're saying from the beginning. She's yeah. saying your mom knew that you were more emotional. Yeah. More, and and the music, that way, the no? music helped them in, you know? Well, it didn't make it any better. Amor, well. <laughs> si but like at that age, did you understand the lyrics? Um, Come on. I don't mess with that. No, I don't think I did. But it's like, so you know how my mom sings, right? She gets into it. Mm-hmm. So she would do like, you know, she gets into it. And I'm like, okay, that, that. I, I didn't know what love was. El sentimiento, pues, yeah, el yeah. sentimiento. And she would get into it. And I'm like, oh, shit. You know, I'm like, okay, I like the song. And, you know, mm-hmm. and luego más con la de cuando chiflaba Pedro Infante. Mm-hmm. Like, I, I get that oh, one. I'm like, oh, my God, that's so beautiful, you know? Yeah, I, I get that. Because yeah. I've, I've talked about, too, like my kids, cuando están babies, que no van a entender ni madre, güey. If you're watching a sad movie as a baby, they would start crying. And you're like, what the fuck? Or, or like if you're watching like a comedy like that, mm-hmm. they feel those vibes. Pues, it's a, I mean, they get a little, they get happy. Pues, yeah. And when it was a sad movie, like they'd literally be fucking have tears when you're like, obviously they don't know what the fuck's happening on the TV, but they get the vibe, the sentiment. They pick pues. up the vibe. So you don't, yeah, I get it. Well, you don't have to really understand to no. kind of to read the, the room and feel yeah. the room. Yeah. So I mean, I don't know. Maybe my mom. When that was she was pregnant with me, she listened to all this music, or she was uh, I was the first one, so it was that uh, no, don't don't make that face, don't make that face. <laughs> oh shit, <laughs> don't make that face. I know because I was thinking, wait, I, did she have a stressful pregnancy with me? No, don't make that face. <laughs> no, you have your character, oh. but oh, you were shit. like, you know, she was always standing up for me. No, yeah, no. well, she still does. No, yeah. de la que te defendía. Dude, with the Rambo shirt, we got beef. You're fucking fault. My brother's hurting. Yeah, está chillando. Yeah, listening to Camilo Sesto. Yeah, but it's true. Por eso nunca me caía bien ninguna vieja. Yeah, no, you were, yeah, Nalia was very protective. And, and, and was I wrong? I mean, I don't know. Oh, yeah. ¿Cómo te llamas, Veronica? We got beef. <laughs> you got sad eyes, ho? <laughs> oh, fuck. I'll beat you down, girlfriend. You know? No, yeah. la, 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 la Who's name por- Veronica? The reason why I ask is because I don't, I mean, I don't, I'm not a man, but are these conversations that dudes can have with each other? Nah. Like, hey, dude. I do. I have them. I have. You I, know what I, mean? I do. I'm different though. Let me let me rephrase I, I, that know shit. How many, <laughs> let me rephrase many, that shit. How many forced conversations I've had with Fernie? Fernie, is that true? Oh no, Ramon, yeah. Pero yeah. Digo, it doesn't. It, yeah, it doesn't have to it can be anything. Wait. So like we he's talked trapped about it, in the truck with me for hostage. Ahora porque no se sentía bien. Se vino calladito. Yeah, and I got yeah, some yeah, words yeah, edgewise. Yeah, he he got to talk, <laughs> and I got and I got quiet for a while. I'm just like. 
Pero yeah, normally mm -hmm. we've talked about this. Me subo, he's like, check it out, where? So this week, <laughs> fucking Tuesday, <laughs> que no sé qué pedo. Well, we're going to start off with when I dropped you off last Saturday. Yeah, we'll no, pick up from there. He, he's like, algo pasó chingo. Tuesday, oh, Tuesday, and he, you know, he gets into it. He's like, oh, but hold on. To set it up. So el domingo. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah. then he goes back to give you backstory. So then, right. And so this morning, te recogió, he was all... Uh, no, I, was, I was falling asleep. Pájaro baleado. Yeah. As he's parking at the old studio, he's like, so how's your week? <laughs> We're about to get off the truck. Ay. Así como te fue, güey. Oh, sorry, we got here already. Sorry. Oh, man. shit, right? Was, llévate la voz de ahí. Yeah. But you noticed que estaba medio callado. Uh, yeah, I was no? just like, yeah. I'm tired. Okay. No, no, he told me going in and then like he said, there was a little bit of silence so then oh. I started talking about fucking my shit. Yeah. But I mean, Oh, he was, uh, he was telling me no, some good shit. Ta so también, good. mental health awareness, like, this will tie in también, and yeah. I think about it. Que but I'm like, so like, before we left the old studio, ponle like a month ago, mm -hmm. or a little poquito. <laughs> Más, güey. Le, le, le tumbé el 20, I guess, a little gacho, because it must have been pretty hard. Then I, we were talking about the same shit, ¿no? Que en the truck, este güey, se pone a hablar, y dice, y I go, And I go, well, yeah, this dude's a fucking, he might be a good friend, but he's a horrible listener. I am. <laughs> I go, he's a fucking, he says, desde entonces, he doesn't wait till we're almost parking to ask me, me como va la sa? He'll tell me a story, <laughs> but like the important bits, and then fucking, he'll stop, he goes, hey, pero, y tú, ¿cómo andas, güey? How you doing, bro? ¿Cómo andas? And then he'll let me get Forget in. Forget my shit, Fernie. How are you doing? He'll, he'll let me get in a few fucking mm -hmm. paragraphs, Illegal. and then but he's like. But we're like three blocks away from the studio, so I'm like, okay. No, but I'm saying he, he. <laughs> <laughs> I, I've noticed, pues, that he's he's tried un poquito más. And I'm just, I'm bringing it up because I appreciate it, pues. Thank and, you, Fernie. And because, like, you. we're saying the mental health thing, that, yeah. que también, desde que my birthday, ando pinche, I, I think it's okay now to call it fucking, uh, what the, is it, mid midlife crisis midlife type crisis? of shit. Okay. Que, que no sé qué pedo conmigo, que la chingada. So I have, like, the week goes, like, up and down really gacho. Yeah. So How do you handle that? How do you, and I mean, the reason I'm, obviously, I'm asking for a reason because, You just said it earlier. In our culture, ¿qué, qué es eso de la salud mental? ¿Qué es, qué es eso? Que tienes, tienes un gusano en la cabeza. ¿Estás deprimida? Ponte a hacer algo. Yeah. Ah, estás, estás estoy triste, pero ven que estás ahí en el pinche teléfono. Ponte a hacer algo. Ah. ah, ah encomiéndate a Dios. No, oh, enfermo, <risa> enfermo que come, caga y mea, que el diablo se lo crea. Ah, Ay, <risa> don Ramón. Don Ramón strikes uh, pop, again. Pops, Pops, did you get this thing? <laughs> did you get this one? This uh, was the next is... Uh, this means you're going to have to call Pops and then be on another conference yeah. call. Oh, I did talk to him. This, I, did, I did talk to him <laughs> on, on Monday or Tuesday. Poor Pops, you're, yeah. you're adding to probably his mental stress. No, si Ramón. it's because I don't let him talk tampoco. <laughs> yeah, he's not a good listener. He said last time on the three-way, he was the only one talking. Yeah. Was, Pero, was, ¿qué was, decías was, entonces él? No, what no, was it? O sea, no, él... Three way. <laughs> no, what the, you're, I don't Anyways, you're, you're three way again. Pero the point is that in our in our, our family, in we culture? don't. We, our parents never talked about being sad or depressed no. or anything. Mm -hmm. Todo era like swept under the rug. Y how, you just get up and go. Get uh, up and go. Get up and go. Vete, vete get up and las go. I mean, I don't remember ever telling my mom. Mama, estoy one well, that when I was drunk that mm -hmm. one time as a child. <laughs> Mama, estoy Five years old. Three. Three. Three, Three or four. Yeah. Fucking yeah. nightmare. I got drunk. You know how oh, the people leave, yeah, people leave their story, drinks yeah. on the floor. Okay. So Eva Noel jugando toda sudada, fucking, I'm thirsty. Y le echaba los tragos a las cubas. A los, the, yeah, you know, the little culitos de la cerveza, yeah. the culitos de las cubitas. And, and then I, they, they thought I got lost or something. She I was, was hiding behind the door. I was not hiding. I <laughs> probably stumbled Yeah, there. okay, yeah. no, well, ahí se quedó toda mierda. St. <laughs> <laughs> Patty's Day all over, bro. It was the first St. Patty's. With my bottle. Uh, uh, nobody knows. That's wrong. No, Elia, mira, aquí está. Portugalí. <laughs> and my mom like, and then when as soon as I talked, I said uh, they smelled the alcohol, let's, let's and then I was like, "Estoy bien triste," <laughs> and then I started crying. Yeah, so like, at three years old, I'm thinking, "What the fuck was I sad about?" No, that you were sad. Yeah, and know. that I started drinking. No, I, <laughs> I know, and those are drunk. <clears throat> Pero back then, we never heard any of that. Mm -mm. Most of our lives don't know. Why. And I I nobody we, does. I mean, maybe now, maybe you don't know. I don't know. I mean, I, I, I think I, I can talk about it now. You know, it's something I don't care. Like, yeah, I'm fucking depressed. I'm not diagnosed with depression. But, you're but I know when I feel off. You know, I know when I'm feeling anxiety. Por eso describí esa, like, yeah. that fucking, I hate that feeling. Mm. 
Pero, yeah, never, never. So now when my mom, I'm like, mom, do you ever feel these things or whatever? Incluso, I was telling her, do you ever have these conversations, mom, con mis tías, when you guys fucking get on the phone, you know, midlife crisis or not? Do you guys talk about these things? You know, I don't think they do. I they don't, don't, even through, I, don't think, I don't no. even think they're going through midlife crisis. I think they're going well, through menopause. No, now. yeah, menopause ya pasó. No, ya pero, pasó. but I'm saying también porque es the, the, that, um, como se dice, the, they, you, you, pues, like, in, in our cultura, pues, you don't, you always have to put your best foot forward when you're in public, pues, yeah. like, you don't want the tías and your tíos and the rest yeah. of the familia know that you're going through any kind of shit, no? Life is always good from the, you know, salgas así, and vas a salir así, oh, and you fucking, oh, you can't tell this to fucking yeah. tal y tal, you can't. And I always wonder, like, y por qué, like, the whole, el que dirán, but then I think about myself how, when I'm going through some things, they're like, I don't want certain people to know, or I don't want people to know, because... A and like not that someone like oh they're gonna talk shit about me I don't give a fuck mm -hmm. it's a sense of like I don't want them to feel sorry for me yeah and so it's more of that well, I, that, the I whole, think I think that's that's a that's a problem too though no yeah or porque, sure can, porque I didn't used to talk about this shit either until was a, a few con Ramon fuck me dio like a fucking ah, a crazy a crazy face but I didn't bring I brought it up that time because tenía un amigo that fucking started telling me about his shit and that's when it's like if me cayó que, oh shit, like it's okay to talk about this. Not only is it okay to fucking bring up this shit, but that's someone else like that, that you know that you're like, wait, oh shit, no, no más soy yo. Like what you're describing, okay, the, the situation might not be the same, but what you're describing, the feeling is it's the a, same. Experience. And that's when I brought it up a que a vez. But even when I brought it up then, I said the same thing you're saying. Like, mm -hmm. I don't bring it up and now bringing it up, I kind of regret bringing it up. Because I don't want those messages, those fucking, I wait, wait, wait fucking like, como dices the, that 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 vibe was the it. attention. You don't want that. that attention. I don't want that attention or that well that type of attention mm -hmm. was it. That pinchy, but, people feel bad or whatever. Yeah, but then as you get older, you realize it was just sorry. It was just in that period that feeling. You're talking about oh, you know you shared common feeling with that friend. Pero eso no va a durar siempre. O sea, you're like oh, I'm worried about this, but I think. No, but I'm saying I, I I said that in relation to when I said it on the show, ah, you, like the face que me dio Ramon. Okay. I don't want that. And then it's the way of a sudden fucking I sending ah. me info and stuff. And then other people, I mean, there's a like a little como dice Ramon, everyone, but like two or three people también mandaron stuff. Like all that, pues <laughs> no, that's what I didn't want. Ah. Pero now I've 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 como dice Ramon. You didn't want grown. people to think it was worse than what it was? No, no, like we're saying, like that, that you don't want people to feel sorry for yeah. you and oh let me try to help them by doing this. Okay. I, oh, I saw that Gary V fucking said this and Salamanda like a motivational. Mm. You see the the, the the pinchy kid you're saying, like fucking you don't yeah. want them to feel sorry for you don't want that. But now like I'm saying, I, I've grown <coughs> up a little bit, I know even that thinking that is wrong, because people are just trying to help, oh, you know, yeah. in their in their own way. Yeah. They care. Yeah, yeah the, the show, the, the and the some people was. don't know how to show that they care, or they I mean, don't know because some people are uncomfortable. Like when you, and I'm gonna say, <laughs> I'm gonna say this because I went to with Jericky and you know them to see a, um, a comedy show. Comedy show. Yeah, yeah. La plática con ellos. Este, we we're talking about another person who was going through like probably a, a heartbreak or whatever. And I asked Jericky, hey, do you guys ask your friends? So he's like, no, no, I don't yeah. talk about that. And I'm like, why not? Like, why not? He, and I don't remember where, I don't think we ended up having a conversation, but I stayed with the curiosity, like, why not? Like, why don't you ask your friend? Not just, I'm not just speaking in general with Jericho, but it came up that why do most men not talk about these things with their friends? You know, I know females is otra cosa. As a female, I know my experiences of when I go through shit, I have my tribe. I have my people that, okay, with this friend, I could, ah, with this other friend, like, fuck that shit. I have my y people. Otra, fuck it, let's go hold, hold it up. Yeah. No. <laughs> <laughs> let's go hold it up. I need to get this shit Not out even. Of. I can't, man. I'm, We're going to the streets. I'm, I'm trying to. Because hold. guys have that too. <laughs> I'm trying to hold it up, but it ain't in me. <laughs> 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 Sorry, God. Pero, oh, también, como dijo Fernie last time, oh, you're at that age. Yes, where I can call my mom like, mija, que tienes? I have no idea. Mm. A ver, platícame, ¿qué te está pasando? Mm. So I'll just, <laughs> you know, y then she'll say her, I whatever to the liquor cabinet again. Whatever she has to say. <laughs> but with men, my curiosity is, how do you talk to your friends? Because Fernie could tell me, for example, hey, I'm depressed. All right. 
Not that I would. But in my head, <laughs> but in my head, the example. But in my head, I would be thinking, well, what can I, what advice can I give him if he's a male? I don't know how males deal with process or understand their yeah. symptoms of sadness, depression, anxiety, well, all that shit, you know, all that shit. So, but so you go like, how do men connect but, with but each I'm other? I don't, I don't think, I mean, like from what you're saying, que, que, like, si te decía a ti, pues, I don't even think that what you're saying kind of um, applies because probably doesn't. Yeah, you, 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 if, if, por decir, if you're el otro compa that's gone through the same thing, then yeah, you, you can, you have a little bit more insight, but I think someone, even if you're not, and if, even if you're not, even if, like, I'm, you're telling me as a, a male and you're a female, I think you could still, you still have something to offer, pues, because oh. you have another perspective that maybe could help. Okay. ¿Me entiendes? So that you don't necessarily have to be between guys. I think between guys, though, it, especially like our generation and even before, like our generation, we grew up, we started bringing up shit like this and the typical the George Lopez, más puto. No, no, no. Yeah, right? llorar. Quiere llorar. Yeah. Quiere llorar. Te, so te, te daban carrilla. So that, that's what we grew up in. Mm -hmm. So you don't bring that shit up, way. So the, even like the, the biggest breakup I had, way, like, Essentially, my friends disappeared. Way, <laughs> so and that was, he, he, like the person that helped me the most was another uh, a female that used to be that I knew through one friend that they did a long time ago. And everybody, she didn't say like in the bola, but she was like on the outskirts. Okay, and somehow le llegó también que I was going through that shit and. Dice, ya. Somehow we started talking. We just started talking, pero nomás ya, así como diciendo. Ya llegó mi chance para lanzarme con el Fernie, ¿verdad? Oh, no, I want to <laughs> say no, but who knows? Who knows? Pero, um, pero no, así just. I talked to her a few times, but but like that's what I'm saying. She offered some advice and some maybe I don't know what the, I don't remember exactly what she said, but que, que helped out with. But como you're like saying, she it's not between guys. It was and it wasn't someone I I normally hung out with. Mm -hmm. Like te aparecía que la fiesta aquí or we're gonna go to this bar and fucking you know, oh shit fucking de vez en cuando la miraba, you know. Mm -hmm. She's still like in the outskirts of the little group. Pero todos los demás fucking scatter because they go, fuck, ahorita este anda su... Anda depre. Yeah, we don't fucking want to be around that. I don't He's know. a buzzkill. I'm assuming. I'm assuming. Pero si se desaparecieron. It might. It might because once again, people sometimes don't know how to react yeah, to a person that's going through something. Especially like we're saying, if in the raza, pues, we never saw that. Yeah. We never learned how to... Yeah. To, I'm, yeah. to deal with that, you know? Not even just deal, but how do you approach it? Like when you see it with people that you know, yo por ejemplo, I've learned that like when it comes to mental health and shit like that, I don't tiptoe around it anymore. I don't because it's like I, al grano, al grano, al grano. Like, hey, what's what's going on with you? Like, I've noticed. Oye, pendejo. No, <laughs> like your brother. <laughs> hey, tú. Hey, pinche inútil. Ven para acá. I don't acá. say oye, pendejo, but friendly loves to. Hey, tú inútil con piernas. Ven para acá. <laughs> You know, Jesus. <laughs> when certain people like I approach it differently, hey, you waste of skin. Hey, you, know, <laughs> <laughs> you walking this. <laughs> See, this you is why we don't talk about shit. <laughs> <laughs> you walking disappointment. Get the fuck out of here. What's going on with you? Why are you so well, sad? Why are you sad? <laughs> yeah, but so you go. Me, I don't tiptoe around it, but I have my uh, the way to approach it. Because it, before it was very much like, hey, what the fuck's going on with you, dude? Like, te veo medio. That's not a soft approach. So when we come in it that way, that okay, oh, I'm very bro, come on, I'm, I'm very um, brutally honest. And no, 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 there's a soft approach. There's a soft approach. To be honest. To show concern. Yeah. And I've learned to do that. Oh, okay. shit. No, pues it's, a, it's, a, it's an everyday thing. Like, time, time to do a fucking TED talk, porque sí, we, it's we need a little bit of that. You know, the soft approach of like, hey, what's, so I've, I've learned to ask those things you know my friends that i'm close with i check in on them like when i don't hear from them like hey how are you doing what's going on anything new no hey you know if you whatever but with i approach it I'm, what i'm saying is i don't tiptoe around it because it's important like for me to check in for people if they want to check in with me that's fine because I, I i'm not afraid to reach out I'm not. Nah. I'm not. I, that's how I used that trait. Not yeah. even. What do you mean? I'm not afraid of what do you mean? That's the way we'll go knock at your house. Hey, it's the way desde, desde chiquillo. Yeah. Desde chiquillo ha sido más este. So you had to learn the way. It was the whole like. <laughs> this is the way. But I've learned to. <laughs> uh, reference to the Mandalorian. <laughs> like, hey, may the fourth be with you. Yeah, yeah. Pues, yo traigo mi camisa I know, and your socks. Es nada. Yo tengo Ay, los estos. But I don't tiptoe around it because. You know, depression, it could do a lot of things to a lot of people. And by my thing, hey, are you okay? I've noticed this. You know, just 
checking in with you. Che- you know. If it's all okay, just. If it's all okay. Yeah. And, and that's how I became closer with some friends during the pandemic when mm. it first started. Because it was like, fuck, I'm, if I'm feeling this way, I know a lot of people are feeling this way. So I would check in with my friends. Hey, what's going on? How are you? Blah, 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 blah. But I try to take a soft approach because it's like, to me, it's serious situations to see somebody deteriorate mentally where you start seeing them being very woo 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 to like slowly becoming something else like what the hell's going on you know so that's why I don't tiptoe around it so what what I mean is, let's pick a little the soft approach then give us that soft some tips. approach of like hey I've no just the way not being like hey tu pinche what the fuck is going on with you man you ain't wild anymore hey, blah, 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 blah. because Maybe to some no, people. No, salido a putear. Que no, pedo. <laughs> no, no, de pinch. I haven't seen your fucking underwear in place. What's going on, girl? No. <laughs> the soft approach to let the other person know that it's safe to talk to me. You're in a safe space to say what you. Pero obviously, no, no más puede ser cualquier pendejo. You know? no. I mean, I'm not going to be like, Fernie, I'm... talk to me, Fernie. No, because Fernie and I, we don't have that. Is that he, we don't have that comfort. Well, I don't know. Pero the soft approach of like, how would you approach your child if they were crying? How would you approach your niece if she's crying? I'm going to give you something to cry about, eh? How would you approach your... <laughs> we're changing the narrative, Fernie. We're changing oh, yeah, the forgot, narrative. I forgot, I forgot. We are not doing what our parents did. <laughs> ah, ¿estás triste? Ah, ¿quieres algo de qué llorar? Ah, mira. Ahorita te voy a arreglar. So I think that, like, approaching that... <laughs> I forgot, my bad. Te voy a arreglar. Me van a arreglar. <laughs> I, I think of it that way, that approach of me, I tell myself, how would I approach a child that's sad? How would I approach a if child you're not good with children? I'm good with children. I'm not good with children. But how, good. Well, what do you, what to you, what is it being good with the children? Like, I don't know. I mean, I, I, I think it's in micro doses for me. It's not like Como micro Yeah like I can't like, you I know. think you're the opposite. No, you, you don't like <laughs> being around children long is what he said. Yeah. I'm not around children. That doesn't children. mean you're bad with children. Wait, that just means... I'm not around children yeah, all the time. Yeah, but like, if I see it, like, for example, it won't... Maybe like they're I have crying. crying. I have late. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> they're crying like, hey, um, your kid's crying. Late. Uh, but the thing is, I'm not around children enough to notice if there is something wrong with them. Like, mm. I would say like, hey, something's really going on oh, with this okay. kid. No, but the, como dice Noel, like, kids wear it on their sleeve. Like, they're, they're sad. You're going to... Like, you, there's no investigating required. Sometimes when I've seen that they're sad is because no los dejaron en el jumper or... Ahorita te doy algo but that's still an emotion. On. Yeah. That's still emotion of mm. sad. Mia, why are you crying? Mira, let me on the jumper. I'm so sad. Well, okay. will you turn? Okay. So he's not good with children? Yeah, I'm not good with children. <laughs> you already shut her is off. That, is that what you're crying about? The jumper? Fuck. All right. Let's go. Vamos a... Vamos. Ahorita te voy a dar algo, And cabrón. that's some shit our parents would do. A ver, vente, pues, vente. Vamos a hacer otra cosa. Yeah. I mean, it va took, a ese señor. It, <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, no. No. I do? Because I've been seeing there's been a lot of those little yeah, like, videos. Yeah, like, what the fuck? Like, <laughs> I mean, what? have you, you, you've been in that situation? No, no, I'm not a no? fucking, oh, man. I went, yeah, maybe once, but I'm like, I don't want to be that um, scary lady. Fuck I, that I don't shit. know how I would do that role. Like, would I fucking step yeah. up? No, no Ramon's like, going to yeah. step up. <laughs> Ramon's going to step up for sure. Come on, you know he's gonna. You think so? I mean, I, I, see, see, me pasó una vez, and, you and I did the fucking like the little memes that Erica Ponen way where, where I was like, uh, yeah, uh, I'm gonna go over there. Uh, <laughs> like, Peter Ramon, que te va a llevar el señor. A ver, you have the, whole, you have the cage there. <laughs> ¿Sabes trabajar? ¿No? Ahorita te enseñamos. Yeah. Ramon saca una maleta. <laughs> All right, vámonos, cabrón. Yeah. Pero por eso digo, like, ah, you're sad about the jumper. Vete para acá. It's not that you're dismissing it. It's that as a person, you're trying to find the solution to stop the child from feeling what they feel. You know, I, I do remember in Maywood, um, I think I was crying or sad because I no me dejaba jugar or something. And uh, one of um, my dad's nephews or a cousin, he gave me a dollar para la, pa la nieve. And I mean, that dollar, I could get a lot of stuff with that dollar. Oh, yeah. yeah. In esos tiempos. Yeah. So I'm all like, oh, okay, yeah. So I estaba yo como pendejo esperando la nieve, but it was raining. <laughs> so <laughs> nunca llegó. But I have the dollar, and then uh, I he think I gave it. it. No, I gave it he to my dad. It. Oh, I gave it, to dad? I gave it to my dad. Because yeah. you didn't need it. No, no, because I'm all like, can you hold it for me? Yeah. And I think he spent it. <laughs> no, of course. Ese día jugando pinche dominó. No, pues sí. 
<risa> y la fuck your dollar. Which is where the trauma starts. <risa> <I know. risa> Jugando dominó. No, but that's what I'm saying. Like, I try nah, to... Uh, you know, there's so many layers to mental health and all. There's too many. Too much, too much shit when it comes to mental health. Not in a bad way. I'm just saying it's a lot, a lot of stuff. Pero me, I'm just like, you know what? I don't have time to tiptoe. If I'm feeling like shit, I'm going to tell somebody. You know, I'll call somebody like, hey, I, I got to just vent. No, no, but it could be possible. I got, a, I got a lot of thoughts. <laughs> what, what if you're like me? You don't got no one to vent to. Yeah. But I mean, I, I <laughs> just... Ah, he's got nothing but... a bad but, listener. <laughs> he's got nothing <laughs> <laughs> Call him when he's on his off of work. You know, I, you got I, that. I'm going to tell you the, the most gotcha recent story. That's the Fuck. way... And I, I think I did tell him, and I think this is why yeah. it changes ways. <laughs> <laughs> so, so un día de esos que vamos en el truck that he's like yeah bro pinche Wednesday ter. ya va como on Thursday I go, go he's wrapping it up yeah well, I've been feeling a little gacho ah you always feel that way so on Friday <laughs> so on Friday this is how it can happen then he just kept going <laughs> it's terrible man <laughs> so that's what I'm saying si so no tienes <laughs> nadie <laughs> no y luego Who knows where you were at in that moment? Que lo que él te dijo, you're just like, Meh. no. Shut. In that moment, yeah, I was like, yeah, whatever. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Ramon, that like no me importa. Now I make fun of it because it was, it was funny in retrospect. That could have been an opportunity for you to. But but in, in, when I think about it, that wasn't the only time he did that. <laughs> Split the time. That was that was not the. Cuando vivía en el rescate entraba todo aguitado. Fernie, turn off the fucking lights, man. No, the porque fuck, bro. No, porque en esos tiempos I, I wouldn't have fucking brought it up at all. No, oh, okay. No, oh, yeah. I, I, yeah. I want to say, only even, uh, yeah, after the evil, and in those tiempos, I wouldn't have brought any of that shit up. But yeah. The only thing I brought up again was when, right before I had my daughter, I like, had those those pre-dad worries. Que, yeah. Que I, have, I have dad issues, and am I going to, like, like type of shit, like, ah, no sé cómo me va a ir, porque I don't know. Uh, But it's a shit, like, you don't, no one knows how you're going to fucking parent, yeah. what kind of parent you're going to be, let you know that way. So now, what kind of parent are you with your kids as far as when they it, like, I, are like, going through something? It depends on my mood, I guess. <laughs> yes. <laughs> no, it's because... Like, you can I, tell, like, right? You can no, tell but, when something's bothering them. Well, that, that, I'm saying they wear it on their sleeve. Well, you know when they're sad. You know when they're happy. Like, they don't they don't know how to hide shit yeah. that way. But like I always say, we're like you make decisions as a parent that you don't know. You don't know for fucking decades or you're fucking... 30 years into it, like Noelia says, like you get to those ages, like, hey, mom, hey, dad, what the fuck? Like, ¿qué pedo con esta madre? You gotta talk, old people. También, también I was talking to someone else que, que kind of gave me some hope that he got like some, some like signs before that way, like, right? So I'm like, oh, okay, so I, maybe it won't be 30 years, hopefully, before I know where I fucked up. I'll have enough time to like course correct. But like, we, we do shit that you're like, yeah, I'm doing good. Like, think our parents, you really think they, they thought they were doing bad way? They, They thought they were doing their, their best, no? Yeah. Like what they knew how to do, how they grew up. Because that's what they grew up in. Yeah, that's what I'm house. saying. So they didn't they didn't do it like maliciously for the most yeah. part. Porque si hay cabrones puñero, los borrachos or borrachas, yeah. or abusive ones, es otro pedo. Pero, yeah. but the, for the most part, though, they weren't being malicious. They were just doing the best they could. So same thing with like like me, because I, I don't know. I hope I'm doing well, but I don't know where I'm fucking up. And I might not know for a very long time. Yeah. So good luck. Yeah. yeah. Stuck no, no. I think pero, about it a lot. All right. Pero aquí tienes el Ramon, come on. <laughs> I'm, come I'm, on. I'm working on it. Okay. I'm working on We it. We need to figure, give you a I'm tool work, that... Rem, that. Um, but look, one thing is that like, I, I, I do ask people how they're doing, but do I let them finish? I... I, I gotta work on that. He mm -hmm. lets him finish no espada so he can get yeah. in his, his, his side of <laughs> the story. I got so, thoughts. So, <laughs> Friday. So, back to Friday, Fernie. No, yeah. you know, not oh, okay. the class. <laughs> I'm like, well, sorry. Yeah. No, okay. he, he, like some saying, since that conversation, okay, that, that one, I want to say it was a five weeks, five, yeah. six weeks ago. No, I think it was Is a little it? bit more, no? Uh, no? I think it must have been like uh, right before, like in February. It was, yeah. it was, it was after. It was like a February. I don't know, but 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 yeah, he's, he's you you. I've noticed he's been trying mass, please. Okay, all he, right. He breaks his conversation when he notices, like in the truck, that he's been going on for a while. Mm -hmm. Y luego te echa la culpa, Freddy. Why don't you shut me the fuck up, man? <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, yeah. <laughs> pero también, <laughs> pero también, like like I'm saying, like from before, I didn't help because I I'm not gonna talk about it anyways, ¿me entiendes? Mm. So se yeah. se pone uno pues que pues este güey no 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 dice much. So se queda callado. So I'm gonna take advantage type of so shit. I'm like fuck. I I mean. I'm a talk. You're like, I, don't, I like to hear myself talk. Might as well. No, I, I don't even hear myself talking. 
I really don't. <laughs> I, I don't hear myself talking at all. I just know that I'm talking. The police and the pops. I know. También, también with the Jericho when I give him a call or whatever, like, hey, what's up, Ramon? Let me tell you, Jericho. <laughs> where, yeah. where do you want to start from? Yeah. Or what do you want? Let, let me let me start from this day. Let's. But before I start from here, I gotta give you some backstory. And I started yeah. back like in December of 2019. <laughs> okay. That led up to this when I was patient zero. And you for would COVID. think that with all the fr- the people that he talks to that are patient enough to listen to him, he would have picked up on that trait to be patient to listen to others. You know. Pero como dices tú, like, it's like, like, they're not, not that they're new relate new friendships. It's just that we're getting to know each other, but they're getting to know me more oh than I get God. to know them. <laughs> <laughs> Because that's the benefit there. <laughs> you know who else I've done this with a lot? El Chapo. El, el Compa El Chapo Ay, from boy. Amor de Chicano. Mm-hmm. I got to call him up. I haven't called him up in a while. Check in on him. Yeah, Check yeah, in yeah. on him. We, we, him. We, we sent DMs. Him. I know that we're okay because I know we DM each other. Mm-hmm. I slide into his DM. Yeah. Like, and sometimes in la madrugada. A ver, Chapito. A las cuatro de la mañana, I send him a DM. Yeah, because I wake up like around 4.30. <laughs> and then, and, and so you think and then he, he, he'll, he'll reply. I'm like, oh, shit, he's awake. Yeah. But he's like two hours ahead of me or something like <laughs> that. <laughs> 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 but t- también, in all this realization of all a bunch of shit, I mean, I'm a bad friend too, way. So yeah. you know, it all adds up. Yeah, but, you know, we're having the conversation. Yeah, so maybe being more aware. Because, like, this is too funny. Like, we're we're older. You, you're you going midlife crisis, whatever the fuck we're going to call it. Yeah. At, you're, you're a parent. You said or whatever, whatever. So I, in the world that we've grown up with, like, in our culture, like, oh, no, ya la hizo. Ya la hizo. Ya, la hizo. ya está bien. Tiene but you're hijos, having your stri- tiene pareja, you're, you're having no, those. Tiene esto, tiene carro. Ya en la, en la edad que estamos <laughs> es like... <laughs> In our 20s, we fucked up, partied. In our 30s, we were a little bit more responsible. Now that we're in our 40s, like, what's next? What's next? And that's when people Plan say, oh, the, the midlife crisis and this and this and that, or they're buying a fancy car. I'm like, I don't call it a midlife crisis. I just call it being able to do shit because now you have insurance. <laughs> you know, the shit I wasn't able to do when I was 20 is because I didn't have insurance. I didn't have the money to be able to buy a nicer car, you know, be a little fancier. Yeah. I'm not in a midlife crisis. I'm just taking care of myself because I was poor, poorer back then. Now, yeah. Now I want to build up my credit. Yeah, and I want to build up my credit. You know, I want to feel the wind in my hair. Yeah. You know? <laughs> then they're like, ay, ya sabía con su midlife crisis. Like, no, I'm just more responsible pero, now. Pero sabe todo el chisme del apartamento. No. <laughs> I don't know how the chisme. I, don't know. I just know what I see. Right. Y me lo estoy yo inventando. Because sure. like... Oh, oh those are the best. I win. Those okay. are the best. That when you make up a scenario, like, oh, fuck. I wonder, like, when I see people fighting, like, when I'm in public and I see, I, I like to people watch. Me too. I love people watching. <laughs> I love no people watching. Us. Shock. I like her. people watching. The thing, is, the thing is that sometimes. Dude, oh. Do you play it off that your people <laughs> watching? <laughs> That's the issue. No, he does not good at it. Pero los pinchos ojos, like. Saca <laughs> <laughs> he takes off his fucking frames and starts cleaning them. Mija, don't miss out on anything. Yeah, sometimes with, with the Mija, when we go out or whatever, we're like, you know, because we go to a restaurant, sometimes we gotta wait. So estamos sentados and everything. And I'm like, oh, she look over there. I wonder what they're talking about. Are they fighting? She's like, I don't know. Like, let's make something up, you know? Like, so we'll do that, uh-huh. you know? We, we yeah. start, you know, like, ah, fuck, están cabrón because I got the dinero on pinches, the, the little chucha shoes and shit. Look at that. <laughs> chucha shoes. Because <laughs> they got, what are they called? The, the, Chuchandalias? Yeah, but they had, they're like the Jelly? Little, jellies. The jelly shoes? The jelly shoes. I'm like, they were wearing them. I'm like, están cabrón porque ya no están de moda. Y les salió bien caro. Her whole collection is worthless. Yeah. Yeah, I've done that too. I'm sure a lot of people, when I've gone out to restaurants or whatever, I'll see couples and I'm like, do you think that's a first date or a second date? <laughs> you know, like, yeah, they, they look too too interested in each other. It's got to be the second date. All right. Yeah. Pero, Pinche Ramon, we got to work on you, man. Listening he, skills. I'm working he's, on me. He's working. He's working. Yeah? On me. I'm working on me. I yeah. am. All right. I'm going to, I'm going to give a Jerky and Pops a, a, a homework. A <laughs> homework. Next time you guys talk to him, I want, every time he actually listens, give him a point. And then we're going to tally it up. And do I get negative points? 
You don't get shit except <laughs> becoming a better person right. and a better listener. All right. You know, that's the thing. Siempre queremos, we want tangible reward. We want throw, something. throw in El Chapo, too. No, I mean, okay, he Chapo. He wants a dollar like he his steel game. <laughs> rewards. No, the reward is you becoming a better listener, you know? And maybe in the future, your friend will be like, you know what? Ramon's a good listener. He's got good stories, but he's a better listener. Hey, mm -hmm. and like, Chapo, guess what happened to me? Like, oh, oh my God, just just to go back with El, el Pops. <laughs> oh God, I was, no, I was I was talking so much that at some point he asked me, you know, to hold on, and I'm listening Te to the back this. No, no, no. <laughs> I'm listening to the background, and then like I guess. I guess the whole family or his, or I think it must have been his younger, younger son. His family it must falling have, apart. Right? <laughs> <laughs> it must have been like waiting for a break in the conversation to ask him something. But como que no entraba la, 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 no entraba la oportunidad. There was no breathing space for Pops to be like. So, so finally, like the son's like, dad, dad, dad. dad, dad. <laughs> I'm, like, I'm like, oh, hold on, hold on, Ramon, hold on. And then I hear him can, talking. Can you call an ambulance? And I'm hearing talking in the back. And I'm all like, I can't believe he did that to talk to his son. I'm all like, <laughs> I'm listening. And I'm all like, shit, did I just like take over the conversation now? <laughs> he, all he did was just text me, you know, something. And then here I go calling <laughs> him. <laughs> he can't even text me with the fear. Because now I'm going to tell the guy that I'm going to talk. Well, Dick, that, that's what I told you a long time ago. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> He's like, yeah, you never, this guy never fucking answers me. I go, I know, because you can't. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Dude, no, porque te llama for the, the smallest thing, but that smallest thing turned into his week. Yeah. <laughs> Pero te llama for like the weirdest, like like a text. Like a, yeah. the little question you can answer yes or no in a hey, text. Hey, Fernie, I was driving and this bird no, no, hit no, my no, window. No, 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 no. I don't remember the time. No, like, hey, Fernie, um, quick question. Have you done this? Or like, hey, can you look into this? And if I don't get a response, I'm like, shit, I don't know that he's seeing. Is he asleep? Is he No, is pero, he busy? pero, pero antes llamaba primero. Yeah. Llamaba primero, and then he got, he got, ya agarró el pinche 20. Yeah, I'm like, este güey nunca me va a contestar. Pero porque te digo, so he asked that, that question, like, why don't you just text me? He's like, because I know where, but I like, you know me, I like to call. Because I so got thoughts. El, el martes, <laughs> so check it out. El martes, I was fucking, oh, no, no, but, oh, did I tell you about fucking a month ago? Okay, so let me start there. <laughs> So that's what it turns into <laughs> where you're like, no mom is. You got good people, man. I you do. Got I got patient people. Though. You got, but I mean, again, it, como dice Fernie, I, I, like, I've been a bad friend. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> pero yo también. I'm not a good friend. Yes, no, que... but I like, <laughs> Like I take over. El que es cotorro. El que es cotorro. ¿De qué eres verde? Don Ramón. Ay, ay, ay. Poor Pops, man. Yeah, so then he tells me he like... He fits the... He oh, fits that Pops. Wait, this yeah. is all adding up now. So because says quita con Pops y Jerky... I get a little wiggle room on Saturdays. So, <laughs> thank you, guys. Porque ya le duele la garganta. Maybe that's why I have las anginas todas pinches madreadas. I did a lot of talking this week. Oh, I way. A lot of talking. He's, right. He lost his voice. Yeah. All right. Fucking. But no, yeah. So then uh, eventually he comes back. He's like, hey, uh, uh, Ramon, I'm going to let you go. Yeah, you know what? No problem, Pops. We I should have left it at that. <laughs> Wait, wait. I should have left it at that, right? All right, Pops. Yeah, no problem. Hey, you know what? I just realized that I just did that thing that, you know, where no. I talk and talk and talk and don't let you talk. And, and now you're trying to leave and I'm holding you up, right? And then he's all like, ah. Uh. All right, man. Hey, I'll talk Dad? to you later, bro. <laughs> Dad? 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 Um, Dad? Um, no, no, the no. dog ran away, Dad? <laughs> like, we need to go find him. Dad, we're, are we're, we going to go find Cookie? Because <laughs> she's been gone for two hours. Dad, we're, we're still waiting on you for the family meeting. Yeah. <laughs> Dad, uh, for the comida, intervention. La comida ya está fría. <laughs> <laughs> we're having, <laughs> waiting for our family moment, you know, for our movie time. It, it, it's still your, your turn on Monopoly. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Dad, we're, oh. we're waiting on you. <laughs> we need your password again. Uh, you, you, you ever gonna move your zapatito from Monopoly? And <laughs> 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 see now, now that I think about it, I'm like, oh fuck, <laughs> damn it! I, I think I do talk too much. No, it's okay. I gotta stop. No, you just have to pick the right moments. Right? Sometimes, yeah, yeah. Mm. It's gonna be look. It passes. Just you know, all the thoughts are in the head that. You know, they're, blah, 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 blah. they're just trying to yeah. come out, but all right. <laughs> e uh, although, though, this this week I did this past week, I did feel special. Somehow Facebook changed my birthday. <gasps> yeah, what? somebody hit me up about it. And I'm like, hey, so-and-so's birthday is on this day, right? I'm like, no, it's on this day. 
Yeah. They told me that. Yeah, so Your Facebook, Facebook said uh, fucking May, hack, fool. May 2nd, 1980. Oh, shit. You know, look. I'm like, well, don't ask woman. Okay. But do I like May? Like, oh, my God. <laughs> May 2nd, I'm like, I don't know. What what kind of sign is that? You got to celebrate know. on Cinco de Mayo. Yeah, no. I don't, I don't know. I don't go on Facebook no more. Yeah, so, like, a lot of people sent me happy birthdays and everything. <laughs> I got I got calls I got texts. <laughs> no oh, shit. Did you correct any of them? I did. I did. I I went oh. on it, and I'm like, yeah. My, and then, somebody um, hacked it. Yeah. Yeah. Somebody. Uh, remember our compa Danny from softball? Mm-hmm. Yeah. So he called me up. He's like, hey, um, I, Facebook's telling me it's your birthday, but isn't your birthday the same day as my daughter? I'm like, yeah. He's like, I'm like, yeah, I noticed. I just got a couple of calls about that and shit. Like, uh, fucking, um, that it's my birthday, but you know, it's not. He's like, yeah, I know. Yeah. Feliz cumpleaños, compa. Happy birthday, Lemon. <laughs> hey, cuz, even my cousins don't know it's when my birthday is. Steve, oh my God, Steve. Yeah, Steve. And then I, I put this thank you all for the birthday wishes. <laughs> <laughs> my birthday is two months away. <laughs> I don't know. Facebook... <laughs> Hold on. I don't know how Facebook decided to change my birthday and chose today. I assure you, today is not my day. Thank you all that. Uh, thank you to all that took the time to post on my timeline. Call or text me. I feel special. But yeah, it was like, you know, Mas, happy birthday, happy birthday. <laughs> maybe hey, my cousin también. Good thing, good thing. Um, good thing. Maybe, maybe Facebook can change my birthday so I can get some. Damn, come on. <laughs> yeah, look, um, it looks, my cousin Saida. <laughs> you know, look. The hell? Belated birthday. Yeah. Not like, belated. That they missed it. We get it, we get it. Aw. Hey, yeah. We yeah. get it, we get I'm, it. I'm going I'm to change my, my birthday on Facebook también, güey. Para que me den poquita atención. So, uh, I mean, fuck. Mm -hmm. So, I was getting all these birthdays. So, I felt special, but at the same time, I got a, like, a little offended. I'm like, why don't people remember my birthday? Because everybody relies on Facebook to just remember yeah. their birthday. They don't have it on their calendar. Even, like, even uh, la, la, la prima de, de la mija. Uh, uh -huh. Yeah, she like, oh, happy birthday, mijo. Because I came out like, Really? Right. Like, you know, we went. Yeah, really? I'm like, nah, but I wasn't. I'm like, thank you, but you know, my birthday is in two months. My brother in law, Tamien, he texted me. I'm like, hey, I don't know to be offended or what, but. Hey, good thing Metro doesn't have Facebook. She would have texted you too. But but she would only done it because he knows que es delicado. Yeah, yeah. And, and even though it's wrong, he's going to want that message. Me acuerdo que en este día, como añoraba que llegaras. Um, you're Mom? three, two, two and a half, three months out. Yeah, like, um. Ya sé, pero no quería que te agüites, mijo. No, no quería que te pusieras <laughs> triste. Porque eres bien sentimental. <laughs> es y era, y era como la gordita de car carrusel. <laughs> la, la romántica, yeah. ¿cómo se llamaba? I don't know. I don't know. Está bringing up novelas. Qué romántico. Yeah. Yeah. Crazy. I know, but. That, that was a weird one, way. It was. So, thank you, you to all. All right. Y happened. qué más pues? What's going on? Because you had a lot of stories before. Who me? Now that we covered men mental health awareness. No, we, there's we a lot of shit to talk about mental. I got more questions. Ramon's got more thoughts. I got more questions. I got I thoughts. We know you have thoughts. We got opinions. thoughts, opinions, <laughs> ideas. I got. <laughs> We've all heard the stories. You're a terrible <laughs> listener. What he doesn't have is listening skills. That's what he does. <laughs> and I used to consider myself a good listener, but I but guess. Okay, now this is the thing, though. All uh, right. When you're there and well, I don't know. That's a problem. I, I mean, it's hard to ask you if you're good when you're first, when you're because if I'm having a conversation with someone, they're talking. What I've learned to do is to pay attention and be present because what's happened other times is gay. I'm already trying to prepare the answer to give them. Oh, I know. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And I've learned people don't always want answers. They just want someone to listen. They I don't think always... it's with certain people. No, there's... No, okay, I've done no. that with certain people. Okay, okay. But I've learned to, like, just let... Okay, I... If someone's talking, I'm like, hear them out. And I do that at work. I, of course, with work and where I work at, I, I've learned to listen, but to be in present. To actually hear what they're saying. Like, are you listening, Manzale? I'm I'm hearing you. Yeah, I'm hearing you. Yeah, I'm, I'm here. I'm listening. Because a veces... I'm focused and I don't say shit and her I don't say shit. Her eyes go crossed. Don't say shit. And, I'm like, and she starts snoring with her eyes open. 
I'm awake. I'm awake. I'm awake. I'm listening. I used to draw fake guys and put them in some machine. I'm listening. I'm awake. I'm here. I'm here. I'm here. But it's listening with the intention to listen and hear. You know, no. Muchas veces we feel like. Oh, they want a, a word of comfort. And no, it's not always that. Just people want to say the shit that they have to say. And if they like, do you, I've learned like, well, do you want my opinion? Would, would, no, I just, you know, okay. Are you going to be okay? Do you need anything? No, I just needed to talk or blah, blah, blah. Okay. Well, listen, go take a shower, drink some tea, do something to just get ready for the evening. Yeah. Como, me sale lo meche. You know, mija, just. Relax, you know. No digo mija, but I'm like, just relax, girl. You know, just drink some tea, whatever is going to make you feel better. Take a shower. Just take care of your body so that your body feels taken care of. And then it matches with your brain and you'll have a good rest sleep. Tomorrow's another day, girl. It's not the end of the world. I know you want the moment to be over with, but I say all that shit. I do. <laughs> I do. Me sale todo eso because. You got the script down. Eh? Not even script. It's just shit that comes out because I know in the situations that I've been in. The things that people have told me, I'm like, oh my god, you're right, you're right, you know. So, is, is you do you, como te digo, assimilate what you would want people to be with, like with you? Yeah, I mean, I do. Like, pero también a veces digo, what works for me, you know? Sometimes it's uh, like, once again, sometimes I won't say shit to people because I think like, fuck, they're tired of hearing me talk about the same thing, and they're they're probably not. And I'll have friends that tell me, bitch, who cares? You have to let it out. You have to talk it out. Because if you don't say it, it's going to fester inside. Se te hace la bilis. Se te hace la bilis. Te sale chorro. Right way. Right way. Because your body's going to start processing it because your mind doesn't want to. Mm. You know? Este, there's times that I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> I'm depressed and I don't want to talk that's, about it. That's a, <laughs> that's a number three special, bro. No, no, no. <laughs> Sadness. That's, that's the anxiety. Yeah. That's the anxiety fart. No, this is when you're walking away from the conversation. <laughs> <laughs> that's Ramon walking away. ¿Cuántos patos hay aquí? Yeah. Pero digo, yeah. the body's going to react to all of that. So that's why it's like, talk about it, talk about it, talk about it. And when we don't talk about it, I'm not saying, oh, to a therapist. It could... To each its own, you know, therapy. For some people, it does work. For some people, it doesn't. Therapy is expensive. Whatever. But to talk about it and just maybe sometimes saying it out loud to someone, it just, it just it takes sometimes a weight off for that moment to know that you're not the only one. You're not the only 40-something-year-old that feels confused about what the fuck is next, you know? What, what, what is my next step? Like, yeah, I try when I have fun and everything, but like, what, what is the ultimate next step now? You know, what, what do I do? So that becomes confusing. That confusion can lead to other shit, you know, anxiety of like not knowing what to do. So I guess you just have to sometimes say it out loud to someone so that it, they could either listen to you or they could just in that moment serve as a vessel to give you the message or the words that you need. Or como dices, no, just, just to get it out, no? Just to get it, it out. It might not even be like you're saying... Just to like, get it out. Need something back. Yeah. Well, for a while too, we, we talked about it with the Esteban where I think it was trending all over fucking like Instagram or whatever way. Okay, everybody, all those little videos que, que, calor. que sometimes like, oh, like, like, like you're saying, you kind of have to read the, the room, the conversation, mm -hmm. pero que, there was a whole bunch of things. Cause me, I remember me and Esteban talked about it que, on one of the episodes, que, like actually asking, okay, okay, con the nice, you see you're getting into this type of conversation. Yeah. Okay, do you want me to help you bef before me gasto? Do you want me to listen or do you want me to help you solve it? Yeah. So I know which way we're we're going yeah. with this. And sometimes I mean that that come says that maybe that's a little too uh bold or too uh but Yeah, but you never know honest. where the conversation comes up because it could be just a regular conversation. Yeah, yeah en la plática sale. Sale las cosas. Yeah, yeah. And and that's what I'm saying. Like you got to read the room yeah. at that point. At that point you're like, "Oh shit. All uh -huh. right, I'll just listen." Mm -hmm. But that's what I'm saying. You 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 have to you do have to really listen to it. even then sometimes it gets confusing, no? Porque you como dice Noel, like you you have an opinion or you want to throw some advice, but maybe that's not what they want. And sometimes that's hard to decipher away. I got then thoughts. It, yeah. <laughs> you need a shirt that says that. <laughs> because then what automatically happens to, it's like, for example, oh, girl, I want to lose weight. Oh, this is what worked for me. When someone's talking about shit, you will automatically, not that you're trying to say them, but you're like so excited to tell them what worked for you to get out of that funk, but it's not going to work for them. It might not work for that person. 
Yeah. You know, a veces read the room, pero a veces that whole reading the room, it comes with experience. Yeah. It comes with being surrounded and knowing how to pick up certain cues. Like, oh, this is the right, oh, you know, yes, look, it looks difficult. And then just some people like Fernie, they're like, I'm not going to talk to Ramon. He's going to shut me off. Well, I don't talk to anybody, but I'm, <laughs> I'm, I'm getting better. I'm getting better. Now, do you not talk to anybody because you really feel like you have no one to share things with? Yes. Okay. But también porque, the, like I'm saying, like the times I've, I've, I've tried. Uh huh. You fucking the backfire yeah. type of shit. Okay. People, not only Ramon. I'm yeah. not even. I, I mean, Ramon obviously the, the funny uh, is the is the funny example. I mean, bro, is the funny example. Pero like even <laughs> with other people that are. <laughs> yeah, no, 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 we, we already, uh, yeah, we've talked about I, it. I okay. keep bringing it up because fucking we've yeah. talked about it, but I'm we've saying that about it. it's the example I can bring up aquí, pues, pero like I, other avenues I've tried, pues, también, I, maybe they don't do it on purpose, but yeah. you do it the once, ya estás media weed, so that, that amplifies it and you fucking, so you should, like you're saying, you shut down a little bit more, but yeah. I, I'm trying at least a little bit more, yeah. but and that's why I, would, I asked the question too, like with men, how do, how do you as men process? You don't. <laughs> well, no, well, I mean, no, not, not even talking. No, it's sometimes like, it's like, hey, let's go out for a drink, or hey, okay. let's go fucking. But you don't go. Vamos a pescar, or vamos a. But you don't talk about it. You just, but you don't talk about it. You, you just go because you quieres ir a hacer algo. To no, but you, también lo sacas de de donde está. Like change the 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 environment, the the area. Okay, bro. but. Uh, see, it's like one that for the ego, this whole talk could be for like three, five, 20, whatever, many hours. In that situation, if you were like, hey, friend, let's go get a drink or something, do you realize that like, I still need something's going on? My friend needs it, depends on the, on on the, the person, person yeah. porque a uh, veces, like if Ramon says, let's go get a fucking drink, Ramon normally doesn't say that, so you go, wait, uh, okay, uh, ¿Qué okay. Está pasando aquí? Pero si dijera, let's go get a donut, let's go to Tams, Fernie. Oh, then vamos, vamos, a, vamos al norms. Oh, then yeah. to you. Okay. Yeah, because al norms is company company business. <laughs> <laughs> oh, like what do we call yeah, it? A, a company uh, meeting. Com company meeting. Yeah. Vamos al pinche norms. Let's go have okay. a safety meeting in yeah. the norms. Okay. You know, but we have that. But I mean, normally, como te digo, sometimes in the drives, you know, we talk. Sometimes, mm -hmm. you know, I, I know I fucking... I don't want to say burden him, but I know I fucking spilled out all my fucking shit like, towards towards Fernie. Yeah, no, he he listens. Mm -hmm. I mean, I have this kid. Porque no lo dejo entrar. Pero también I gotta do like what we're talking about. I have to gauge: is he looking for me to give him answers or yeah. like a, yeah. like yeah. some advice or no más? He's just trying to get everything out. Mm -hmm. And I mean, I don't know if I'm doing a good job at that, but all I'm saying like I the, think so. But I mean, I'm saying you, it, those are situations, boys, yeah. that like we're talking about that you gotta like navigate and kind of. Find yeah. clues in the conversation. And now you guys are at a different age too, where it's like these conversations just stand on the window, like, oh yeah, like I feel safe with my friend. Yo, por ejemplo, mi bestie, este, tía mamas. Uh -huh. I know her since we we're in the fifth grade, so they're pretty much family. And I know she's the type que she gets uncomfortable with people crying. I know that. There have been times I call her and I'm like, ah, I'm like, you le digo, I know you're not comfortable, bitch, but just hear me out. And that's. That's all I I'll oh, so say. You make it easy though. I make it easy cuz I know her. I know what she's uh, that it makes her uncomfortable cuz hay una gente que no sabe qué decir, no saben cómo Pues you're crying, está cabrón. Yeah. No. <laughs> you know, me sale todo, you know. Me, me sale el demonio. Es que no, I know. I'm playing Monopoly right now. No, este, can I call you back? Yeah. <laughs> Much <laughs> my, my son's waiting for me. No. Why, why don't you call Pops? <laughs> He's not doing hey, anything. Pops, I got thoughts. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, man, you, Pops deserves an award, man. Oh, Pero yeah. that's why it's like I, with females, you know, it's different when we feel depressed or anxiety or whatever. I know in my experience, I've seen it manifest differently in females than it with males. Males, my experience has been, they shut down. No, you know, there's certain things that I'm like, okay, esto es algo está pasando, you know, but I don't know how to approach it, whatever. So I'm like, how do you deal with it? Like, man, what do you, when do, when do you, Ramon, know que te estás sintiendo aguitado? Oh, Oh, <laughs> oh, <fuck. laughs> oh. Why did I ask uh, this question? <laughs> no, no, no. It, it's like so in 1947, <laughs> uh, the baby boomers June were, were, were springing out. 
June 24th <laughs> was about 10:35 a.m. No, look, 11, my dad was 11, even, my 11. Dad wasn't even born in 47. Uh, my dad's a baby boomer. My dad's 49. Your dad's yeah. a baby boomer. Does, does, yeah. does a Mexican count as a baby boomer? That's around that era. No? <laughs> they call them becerritos. <laughs> Los becerritos. I mean, like what Gen X is like. Even in Mexico, they're not Gen X or what? Oh, yeah. No say. Mm, Gen X is. I think those are like American type terms, right? Really. Like I think, yeah, so. but I'm I'm sure there's a lot of there's a lot of raza that 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 fucking some of Gen X that that relate. Yeah, us, that but I'm saying some of the nueva generation. But I'm saying the baby boomers were porque vinieron just, back from yeah, the from the, the guerra, pues, in Mexico, mm -hmm. pues, they didn't come back from the guerra. They were still there. they never yeah. left. Well, there was some. There was some. There was some. Answer the question. How, how do I? <laughs> how do I? <laughs> pero directo, because we're. I mean, we're gonna be talking about this. Like it's. There's when a lot to cover recognize? here, she says. When, when I recognize this, when I feel like I'm suffocating. Oh, but then you already got you. Yeah, I'm already got you. Like, Pero, I see it building up, but in my mind, I think that, some, you know, I'm always hoping for the suffocating best. Suffocating como? Like, you're literally like this like, or like... Siento, you know, like, uh, como te diga, like, like, everything is crapping me in. Like, if mm. I'm in a room... I feel like I'm like you know even this room it's it's big enough right yeah but I, I feel like claustrophobic Why? it feels claustrophobic well, also. for me I know <laughs> I feel like you know como que you know yeah. like me, me estoy ahogando like I'm like I need to I need mm -hmm. to get out but luego si salgo it's just like it's luego me pega el, like, a little anxiety from yeah, being out anxiety and mm -hmm. it's just like fuck yeah go like mm -hmm. I'm I'm helpless right now. Mm -hmm. So at the same time, sometimes I don't like to burning people until like I get to that point where like I can't take it no more. That's what I've called you. That's mm -hmm. what I've told Fernie. Mm -hmm. That's what I've told Amija. You know, it's just like, yeah, esto me está pasando. Like I I don't know what to do anymore. But I always let it get. I always let it build up to that. Mm. I don't like try to get something because. I don't know if it's acidia. I don't know if it's fucking procrastination. I don't know if it's like, again, the optimistic in me where like, okay, things are going to get better. I don't want to cry wolf just yet. Mm. Or it's just because we've been taught to wait till everything's about to blow up to say something. Well, I mean, we've been taught to hold it in. Yeah. It just blows up. It's and not it like you're waiting up. for that time. Like, yeah. That's not what you want. But yeah. también to give you a Ramon example, in <laughs> Cuando he was having his bad year, cuando he was having all the accidents, el madre. <laughs> they rammed him from behind. Que le decíamos yo a Esteban, like, en mi episodio, go, hey, bro, you're getting a little fucking, they're all grumpy and a little <laughs> angry. I'm not fucking angry. What do you fucking mean, bro? Yeah. <laughs> I was, uh, what was it? The, the... I just had fucking my back hurts because of the fucking accident. <laughs> That's it. Me la tronaron por atrás. No way. Me la por Detroit. Me agarran por Detroit. That's yeah. it. That's it. All right, bro. All right. All right. <laughs> All right. Just, yeah, the pain he, was. Yeah. And I'm saying at that point, he still hadn't realized pues, that it was all like piling on yeah. him. At some yeah. point, he did realize it, but como he said, like, when... He yeah, yeah, cuando ya no puedes más. Yeah. And he's like, well, you guys are right, bro. Like, uh, yeah. And yeah. After I was, that, I mean, you know, I, I, I think I, I started trying to, like, go about it differently. And, and I did, but then sometimes it's like, you know, it reverts back to your old habits sometimes. And, yeah. And so we're a work in progress every day. Porque <laughs> eso, eso, como he says, we've been taught to shut the fuck up. And now you're in a space where, like... It's building up. I know I shouldn't let it build up, but I don't know how to stop it when it's first starting because I've never been in a place to be able to stop it before it and started. We were never taught what it We were never it. taught. Entonces, we let it get to that space. And por eso digo, it's all every day you have to work on that. You know, every day is something. It's, yeah, and it's sort of like you waited, like you waited too long. Or yeah. It's just. Y por eso hay gente que, pues. Unfortunately, they get to those spaces of. No, no, that's just something way different. Like, que se they kill the suicide thing, you know, where people just. Uh, that's pedo, yeah. Eso es otro way, 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 way different pedo, but it's understandable sometimes how that desperation, especially because people, yeah, even people that are having treatment, it's just like you. That's that's a something you just can't fight, you know. No. Yo no, I mean, I'm not saying going, pero digo cuando han pasado situaciones así. For example, I saw this um recently, this Olympian from 2016. She was this chick. Que, She was in oh, the Olympics yeah, yeah. and she she was found dead in her apartment a few days ago. And now they're saying that she did have severe depression. She had it, all these things. And to me, when I see that, when I see things like that, I'm like, dude, it's these people. They have the perfect. Suppose. Yeah. The, the, they have it the all together. Image from the outside. Yeah. They have it all together. But 
inside in the home it's a different beast. Pues ya ya ves cuántos músicos and like oh, like yeah, if you want to talk famous people pues oh, yeah, like, yeah. how many famous people you go wait wait look they're having a fucking great mm -hmm. a great fucking life you don't in esta playa and filming over here in Hawaii the like, this. And before it was always like oh it was always attributed to drugs but it's like well, what led them to start yeah. using substances? Por eso layers and layers and layers and layers. That's something like this is a topic, a discussion, a subject that forever, ever, ever will just continue and continue yeah. and continue. You know, it will continue forever. The whole issue is like, oh, you know, the homelessness. Housing them is not going to fix shit. It's not going to fix shit. Housing is the visual that we see to fix the problem. But a lot of these people are mentally ill. They cannot afford the services. If they could afford the services, some of them don't want it. Yeah. But I mean, they, and the drug use, where is that coming from? The drug use is stemming from something. Yeah. So it's do, 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 do. Nunca se va a arreglar. Yeah. yeah. Fixing the homelessness situation of having people they, in the streets. When they've done the, the, the studies, though, the, most of the homeless aren't in that situation. Oh, what situation? And that's okay. They're, they're, they have mental. Well, yeah. I mean, I mean, everybody has mental health issues. But yeah, I'm yeah. saying like, they're not they're mentally not, ill. But they're I'm, no, but I'm saying okay, that's not the, that's not why they're homeless type of thing. That's not the, like their, their primary issue. But So it's a, the housing, if we would fix the actual housing, it would alleviate it a lot. And then you get to the point where, you, no se ponle el, que faltan 40% or something. Que esos son los que, it, yeah. get, it gets tricky because it's more mental health stuff. Que no quieren ayuda, que yeah. están on, that they're, they're on drugs or whatever. Yeah, like, for sure. So they yeah, got a bunch that's of like, other problems. You're never going to solve the homelessness problem. But I, I don't know if never. I, I, I mean, I like not in our hopeful. lifetime. I like to be hopeful. I like to be hopeful. I mean, my <laughs> my, like, my kids are gonna maybe live on the island of California, but um, yeah. Pero digo, por eso, like, when it comes to that, like, yeah, it's just too many layers with that. But por eso te pregunté a ti, like, when you have felt that, like, that suffocating feeling, you know, whatever you do. Pero hay gente que they don't know what mm -hmm. to do. You know, should just get. I heard read too this other um day this man, some famous business guy. Say so he took his life because financially he was there was too much going on. And it's like fuck, you know. Well, yeah, was all, all the kids too. Like when I mean, this started a while back, but all, all the kids now get them in. Like they're young, and you go like, what the fuck? Like why are those suicide rates so fucking high for yeah. kids when you're kids? And I understand when you're kids, any little pedo seems like really big. But then, like we've talked about before, like with social media, that just exponential. No, like yeah. your little problem that you already think. As a, as a kid is fucking huge even in your 20s yeah, in your 20s something happens and fuck bro like mi pinche vida ya valió verga you go well no dick you're 22 you'll be fine like you'll bounce back yeah, fine. It, does, it doesn't feel like it yeah. but I'm saying what, and then when you add social media and all that shit on top that just multiplies it and multiplies and multiplies it's like fucking squared and cubed and it's a lot so, it's a lot So the 10th exponent yeah start, you fucking you need a quantum computer to break that shit fucking apart yeah. with y tú, Fernie, how do you, what do you experience when you're, when do you know when you're like, okay? Oh, I know. I mean, I've dealt with it for a long time. So, I mean, pero yes, I, I but do we, it, we don't know. But I do it on my what own. What do you experience? <laughs> o sea, pero como le pregunté él, physically, what do you feel or what, what do you experience to know like, okay, I'm something, I'm off, I'm off. I'm not in my. Oh, well, I'm, I'm, I know when I'm off. I'm most of the time like that would say I'm off. But I'm saying like, most of this happens when I'm like, because I, a little less now, porque I've been trying to fucking not do it as much, pero. I like to work more like at night because everything's more quiet and even fucking, but not not many distractions, la chingada, no? Pero también is when the fucking brain, my brain starts going because now I don't have to be worrying about fucking, I bet fucking the kids want snacks, the kids mm. fucking this. Este güey está gritando, ay, ¿por qué está llorando este? Te, te voy a dar algo para llorar, cabrón. <laughs> like none of that's happening, right? So my brain, <laughs> that's when it really gets going. And then that's when I go down my own little rabbit holes, mm. pues, where you start, I start one little thought and fucking me distraigo and I go down that rabbit hole and yeah it, it just feels fucking I, when I brought it the first time I described it this way it goes like I go down that little rabbit hole it's like fucking this dread like hopefulness way like there's no hope for fucking no tengo hope like yo like for, for myself or whatever but back then I was taking the kids to school so at some point I had to snap out of it that's what it snapped out hey wait you got shit to do mm. you know what snapped me out of it but then it could be it came back then the following night or it could be The fucking a week from now, but it's always like that dread, that fucking hopefulness, like hopefulness, hopeful, hope, hope, hopelessness, hopelessness is what I'm looking for. Yes, 
Gracias. So, pinche, I, I get like really fucking that pinche black, little black hole of my, just, it's just me. Y también, pues, a mí a esas horas de la noche también, who are you going to talk Pero to? Pero what is, okay, what is your body feeling though? What is your, like, does your stomach hurt? Do you, like, do you start moving your knees? Are you sweating? Like, physically, what is your... I don't start sweating, but no? fucking, I do have a lot of like little ticks. Mm. I get a lot of little like ticks going, pero mm -hmm. como estoy solo, I did, did not, doesn't really bother anything. Yeah. Pero también like the, sometimes it just goes, like all week I'll just fucking be dragging ass. Like, Are fucking, you a snacker when you're like nervous or like... When I was younger, it was the opposite, no comía. When around, I, I want to say we're around, no, I don't remember when the change was, but at some point I started, when we started snacking, like when I got depressed, I started snacking. Before no comía, I would lose weight. Then I fucking would gain a chingo weight because mm. I'm fucking snacking. Ahorita, it's probably somewhere in the middle. I guess it depends on the thing. But ahorita with the, the other stuff that I'm constantly processing now, fucking, like you're going reviewing the tapes of your life type of shit, like midlife crisis, like I'm saying, because I don't know, I don't know. I don't know what else to call it because it's been now going since since like the end of December type of shit. It's been less than a year, Fernie. No, but I'm <laughs> but I'm saying that normally, como te digo, me llegan <coughs> in little things. And no, be, pero if it's not just the night, it might be a few days and then it passes. Ahorita, it's been like literally going up and down for for the, all these months. For fucking but uh, no, months. I'm, I'm just saying it's been since December, so it's normal that these feelings are still there porque a veces decimos, ay, it's been six months and I'm still feeling like this. So it's it's normal. There's no timeline to when you're going to feel better about something. Mm. Nah, that, that, I mean, you know, por eso digo, this whole, like, whatever you're describing as a midlife crisis, like, it's going to go maybe for a little, but it's just what you're going to do with it. But I'm saying, you know? it, it it's another layer, pues, on top, pues. Yeah. So, like, instead of just that little rabbit hole now, mm -hmm. I'm st I still go in that little rabbit hole, but I already start, like, halfway down, ¿me entiendes? Like, so I get there sooner. So, like, I drop down into that fucking hole much sooner than... The normally, pues, like, I'll fucking, you know, you get a little wind up. Te, te vas yendo. Ahorita ya voy como la mitad all the time. I'm always fucking halfway mm, in the well, hole. Well, you default to that middle part. Mm. No, like, I'm, like, every day I'm, like, already starting halfway in that hole. So, like, yeah, maybe I crawl out sometimes, pero that that fall is much shorter, pues. <laughs> like, Aye. so, like, any little thing fucking me tira para abajo. And sometimes, like, you'll climb out and I'll still go down that rabbit hole. Pero every day I start, like, in the middle. Okay. ¿Me entiendes? So, mm -hmm. I'm, every day I'm starting negative. So lo que te digo que está cabrón over the over months, yeah. pues it, 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 even that pues puts another layer on it. Like I'm saying, you're like, well, dick, yeah, we go, yeah, we, no, no, there's no timeline. But for you, you're like, fuck, it's been four or five months. Like, yeah, yeah we, yeah, ya se, yeah, por favor, type of shit, you know? So it, it's another layer on top. Yeah. But then I, th I feel like... So se voy ahí. <laughs> sin los tacos. <laughs> sin la carne asada. Y sin el cilantro. Sin cilantro. No tortilla. Yeah. Limoncito. But, and and then you ask, ¿por qué es sabuita uno? You know? Y si a veces no yo pienso que... que... <laughs> <laughs> I think sometimes, I like, we... <laughs> <laughs> we are so, like, our minds, like, all right, get over it. Because it's just our own fucking demons talking to us. Letting us know, like, no, 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 get over it. But then the body is, like, reacting to it. You know, por ejemplo, yo... I mean, I my I don't know how to describe mine, but yo sé que cuando me siento así, like fuck, like out with females, it could be there's, for example, a week or two, a week before my menstrual cycle, I do feel <laughs> extra emotional. I'll see some random shit, and I'll start crying. I'll I'll be driving and I'll hear a song, and it just reminds me of some shit. And I'll cry, and I tell myself like, okay, no, yeah, what's going on? Are you crying because you're stressed about something? Or are you crying because yeah, this when you cae el cinco like bitch you're gonna get your period. So I know. El That's, cinco el veinte. El veinte el cinco lo que caiga que caiga. <laughs> lo. Está poniendo el cinco. El cinco. Ya bottom. se le fue el tren. No me topa. <laughs> 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 al menos te dio un cambio. <laughs> <laughs> no soy nada. <laughs> Pero oh, out, por ejemplo, I don't know. <laughs> shit. shit that I've been through in the last two years, whatever. I'm still in the, come on, see, see how there's a grieving process yeah. and the grieving process has steps. I'm in, still in the anger, the not, not denial, the anger part of it, of the grieving, because, you know, I still have like, what the fuck? Like, why did all this shit happen? And not just that moment, but I'll say I went through a very bad breakup, but with the breakup also came seeing shit with friends. So it was breakups with friends too. So it made me angry. It was like, what the fuck? 
Like, I was here for all of you, motherfuckers. I was here for all of you. I've learned to be there without asking for shit. But what I did for them never was reciprocated. So that's where I'm at, where it's like I'm trying to not still be angry about it because I think that my anger comes from not having been able to tell them off the way I wanted to. Mm. Y como you don't have closure. I wear him. That's that's what I interpret as closure. But maybe the closure is just like you get vaya con Dios. over with them. Vaya con Dios. And that's where I'm at right now. But a veces todavía the old shit comes up where I'm like, ah, it's a beautiful man. <laughs> but I have to be like, no, no, no. Let go, let God, and que les vaya bien. You served your purpose. Life will re will reward you with now placing the people or whoever it is that will reciprocate what you've given. You know, so yo estoy, yo sí me siento que I'm in that angry phase and I'll talk to my mom and I'll be like, es que mamá me siento así. And, you know, my mom, she is who she is and she tries to understand me and she gives me her advice. Pero yo cuando me siento así, I do say, okay, bitch, get your dog, <laughs> go on a walk. And I'll just, como, and it's true, I do do that. Like, como dice mi mamá, encomiéndate en Dios, I, I, encomiéndate, encomiéndate a Dios. I pray, I just, whatever I have to do, and I'll be, I'll go on my walks, and the air helps. The yeah, fresh for, air for helps. you've been doing a lot of walks. I take, I take very long walks, para que, the, pa que entiendas how bad it is. No, but it's, <laughs> now I'm like, now I know I'm an adult, because I actually want to go on a walk, and not complain. Porque antes they're like, okay, go on a walk to get your steps, and or whatever. Now it's just like, no, I, I want to go on a walk. Why well, I go out to get my, my steps and my I heart wanna, points. Yeah, I want to feel the air. <laughs> I want, I'll put my headphones on. I'll just sing and I don't give a fuck. Like, there's a lot of crazy people out and I'm like, we're What's all going less? through the same What's shit. One more, I mean. No, my thing. Yeah, we're all going through our same shit. Like, you're singing, I'm singing, whatever. It's a beautiful. And it's a story that can see. Like, it still have, I'll have moments where I'll be cool and then just suddenly like, hey, bitch, remember that people fucked up on you? Yeah. And then that starts the little voices in. It's like, fucking, yeah, those little voices are fucks you. But then... I have to be like, no, no, like, yeah. let let life take care of what it has to take care of. You can only take, that's when I do the serenity prayer. God grant me the serenity to accept the things I cannot change. I cannot change that people were fucked up with me. What I can change and what I'm in control of is the, the attitude, mm -hmm. how I choose to respond to it. Now, you guys think that I go out picking fights and I don't. Like I'm the nicest person. I'm very, very nice. And the shit that I'm always battling is letting that enraged bitch come out. You know? You're the Hulk. <laughs> <laughs> you're the Hulk. <laughs> she Hulk. The She Hulk. I don't know. With, I've never with, seen it. But you're with, all, without no. your license degree. Yeah. <laughs> yeah without pero, the bar exam. So I'm, like, I'm always, you know, people that are in recovery of drug use and everything, every day it's they are true. fighting with those demons. There's people like myself that every day I'm just like, Noelia, don't let this shit trigger you. Don't let this person that cut you off fucking make you go ape shit don't don't let don't get triggered over these things control yourself and those are the things that i deal with that anger and i'm i'm always trying to figure out like where does that shit come from but then i now it that comes get, from that radiation que. radiation <laughs> no, from chano <laughs> from my dad Los toxic. <laughs> my dad and then i think of his family and their traits and then i start thinking about his parents and their so i'm like it's a whole general lineage of This emotion. Toxic radiation. This emotion. But it's so like, you're toxic. I'm not, I'm not. I've told Jerry, I'm not toxic. I'm dramatic. Gamma rays, bitch. I'm undramatic. <laughs> o sea, <laughs> <I'm> not, <laughs> like gamma, <laughs> toxic ah, gamma rays. I'm, scandalo, but I'm not going out there to ruin people's fun time or moment. Oh, no, no, no. You're not that type of person. If I no. fuck up, I think you, of all people, know that when I, now, when I fuck up, I will say, like, you know what? You're right. I fucked up. Mm. You said I was this. I'm like, I did say it. Because at that moment, that's how I felt. And I apologize. But that's not how I really feel. Whatever. But I do take accountability when I fuck up. It sucks. Because you're like, fuck, I fucked up, I fucked up. Ni modo, ni modo. But now I'm in that space where it's like, with the friends that I have and the people that are in my life, I'm like, I cannot afford for you as my friend to feel any type of way when approaching me about anything. You know, y por eso digo, shit that I've been through with friends and exes and it's like, what the fuck? Like, I gave myself 100% in the friendship and the relationship, whatever, and this is what I got. 
So es lo, eso es lo con lo que estoy ahorita todavía. And I tell my mom, like, I, wanna, I want this shit to be over with. I want this. I need a Hulk out. I need a Hulk to fuck out. You know, and be more, I don't know, who's another hero? Hi Iron Man? I don't know. <laughs> who's another positive? Oh, Captain America. Captain America, whatever. Pero lo que digo es que when you know your triggers, when you know the shit that's going to trigger you, you, you either choose to work on it or you don't. I've had those situations. También que me siento... Holy shit. Ooh, I can't oh, breathe. Like more panic, like a pan I, panic yeah, attack. Yeah, and it's shit. weird because anxiety. I didn't know how panic attacks work. I never knew what anxiety was. The, when I was younger, like, oh, the butterfly feeling. That's not fucking positive all the time. <laughs> no. That whole butterfly feeling is not always good, you know? So it's all these things. It's, just, it's, it's a release. It's a release, <laughs> you know? It's, you know? Oh, shit. All these things. So I'm learning, and it's a, a, every day, every day, every day, you know, I... Me desespero. Me desespero. It's like, oh, I don't want to feel this anymore. There was a time that key, I understood what it was like to say, I just want to close my eyes and I want this shit to be over with. And I never knew what that meant. You know, y yo se lo dije a una friend. They're like, are you like suicidal? And I'm like, no. No oh, shit. Yeah, because I was going through my shit. And I was like, <laughs> like, I want this shit to be over with. I just want to go to sleep and not wake up. And I'm like, no, like, I don't know. Like, I just want this moment to be done with i want these feelings to be done with because i can't move on and being where i want to be because i'm still dealing with this shit so now two years two and a half years later like i feel like now i'm like okay that that portion is done but it's, you still got more to work yeah on. i still feel like when i think of certain things and situations and people i will get like but like you know what it's all right i still get to go home I still get to be with my doggy, you know, my doggy's been, you know, me, me savior, of, I know, uno. me number one. She's just like me. <laughs> she really is just <laughs> like me, yeah. my baby girl. I wonder why, you know, pero si también, thankfully, and I'm very thankful that I have people that I know I can go to, you know, yeah. call my bro. I'll be like, like, I don't know if I, but I'm like, you know, yeah. Um, oh, but like you're saying, you call your mom. I'll call, call my your, mom. Your amiga. I'll call friends. But I do want to put the ego. There are certain friends that I'll be like, this is who I can go to to be like, fuck this shit. Ah! They're like, yeah, there you go, girl. There you go. Then there's others that I'll be like, girl, I feel like shit. Like, ah, blah, 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 whatever. You think con meche is the, the, that motherly nurturing thing that I need because I tell her like, hey, like, we're making up for the shit that we didn't do when we were, when you, we were younger mom yeah. you know we were neglected not by your choice yeah. but now as an adult that I'm able to tell you this now you know what it is that we needed and we're still like yeah. like I was telling you about Kevin Smith yeah. like oh, yeah. he said there's I'm still that nine year old and I told him like, I'm still that fucking you 11 yeah. 10 year old girl that's just confused about shit you know oh, tell him about the Kevin Smith <laughs> oh no oh yeah yeah so <laughs> I was talking earlier that game Kevin Smith the director of Clerks Dogma Chasing Amy Chasing Amy um, I saw a video that he posted on YouTube it's a YouTube video from People Magazine and he was talking about how he was hospitalized he shared about how he was sexually violated at 6 years of age where someone made him do shit with people um, and then at nine years of eight, nine years of age, he had two incidents where he was body shamed. So those two things were pretty much the the base, like the catalyst for everything. No, the foundation of what he became, because in him trying to protect that kid, he became his other persona, the director, the funny guy, the chubby guy, blah 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 blah, blah all this shit. But he said in the video, he's like, I've always been that nine year old that I was just trying to protect but i like the video that he because i was like hey the way he's talking is like i can understand what he's saying because yeah. sometimes it's like we want to use big words and it's like the fuck is this bitch saying so the way he says it is like i understand what you're talking about because he's talking about trauma our brain the amygdala how our amygdala is the one that takes in memories and all this other shit whatever and then he goes into how that trauma still impacted him, how he felt, well, yeah, I was violated, but it's not as bad as somebody else. Uh, yeah. But the thing is like, you were still violated. Violated. You were still this, you were still that. So I was, when I was watching, I was like, because <laughs> his thing too, as a child was like being a chubby kid that everybody made fun of. So he was like, I'm just going to beat the punch. And I'm like, yeah, 
I'm we're the same, you know. I still only go. I go through my shit. And when I go through my shit, I think of like, no, how would you talk to yourself if you were ten years old? Oh shit! So that's when you said, how do you approach compa- How do you approach someone compassionately? I think that how would I talk to a child? How would I talk to myself? How would you talk to yourself? At you 10 know, years, what type of shit. You, I, I, and see, then, that one makes more sense than, at least to me, that makes more sense. Uh, how would you talk to a child? Porque it depends on the child. You that's know, but true if, too. You're, if you're if you're thinking about it, like, oh, how would I talk to myself as a ten year old type of thing? Yeah, that, that makes it's a little more narrow, boys. You know. And I saw this thing too, que decía, like the person you are today is the person that you needed when you were a child. And I'm like, I don't know about that. Yeah, that's not, but, no. <laughs> I don't know about that. No, one. but. Not I yet. do think Not like, well, how would I talk to myself as a child? And that's, and, and I worked with, for, before the job that I'm at, for like six years, I worked with youth in probation, parole, foster care, adopt, all these kids that were removed from homes. And it was like, I have to learn to talk to them. I have to learn to listen to the, at their level, yeah. you know, but it's so with all that practice, it's like, no, like we're all damaged. Well, I don't want to say all, but a lot of us. I think everybody has a little bit. The issues that we have is just a, a child whose needs were not met because our parents didn't know how to meet those needs because our parents' was goal was to pues, a la I mean, escuela. But por eso, porque ellos están igual. They're stuck somewhere yeah. too. Where, so. You go to school, we, your dad, you know, con que haga comida, con que haga, vayas a la escuela y no en pendejadas. And you still believe in God? Because, of course, oh, yeah, got yeah. Country, then we're good. Somos católicos. <laughs> then we're good. Apostolicos y romanos. <laughs> then we're well, good, I mean, you know? But, por eso digo, like, I, this whole thing of taking care of ourselves, taking care of our mind and our body, it's an everyday thing. Everyday thing. And life. some people, it's hard for them to do the work. Por ejemplo, si yo quiero perder peso, I have to do certain things for, to achieve that goal. Yeah. It's maybe easier to do the physical stuff, but then mentally, I'm still going to have that dysmorphia because yeah, all no, of no, it no. is up here. So a lot of times when it comes to taking care of our mind and processing our triggers and because a lot of it stems from childhood, there's a lot of areas that we're not going to cover. There's a lot yeah. of areas in our history that we're not going to be able to cover, but that some people don't want to do the work with the things that they can work with. If I want, if I go to therapy and my therapist tells me like, well, these are the things that you can do to keep managing your anger, to keep managing these things. Some of those things I'm not going to want to do. Yeah. Part of losing weight is maybe going to the gym. I don't want to go to the fucking gym all the time. She's peleles apestosos. But I, but I think you're right. Sometimes the, the, the physical pues is easier because you know how to handle that pues. And it's more, um, the progress is more visible. Yeah. And then, y porque también... I, I don't know. I think I brought this up before. No, Ramon probably it's a Savon memory will remember or not. But or maybe it was before or after. I think. But one one time what, with one girlfriend long long ago and probably my early twenties. Cuando fue? I think early twenties. But she this was the exact the wrong way to do it. But she pretty much conned me to go see a therapist. Like if I come almost like a a couple therapist type of thing like she was she said she was gonna go but she goes oh pues quieres ir a esperar conmigo type of thing and then oh pues quieres entrar conmigo pues eh, whatever <laughs> and then when the fucking yeah me dieron the fucking so you are you ready to discuss things and I straight up told him no I'm not ready to discuss things and and ya le explico ya well if he, if he doesn't want to talk about things I go no I didn't know this was happening I'm not ready I'm not I go I'm not ready to fucking go through some things that, that I, that I need. I, there's stuff that I have to process that I am not ready to talk about. He was like, well, okay, thanks for being honest with me. I go, so if you want, you can fucking go wait in the lobby. <laughs> yeah. And your, your opinion, would your, your feelings would probably not have changed. Even if she would have told yeah. you, Hey, no, they wouldn't have. Cause because you weren't, you were not in the space to even talk about. And that's okay. A lot of people, there's things that they're like, I don't want to talk about that. No, the, well, I, I straight up told him I'm not ready to discuss what I need to discuss. Please. Yeah. Like I'm not in that headspace yet. I'm not there yet. And that's a lot of self-awareness and a lot of people yeah. don't have that. Yeah. So pinchy because I, yeah. Yeah. It just, it is and it is. was just fucked up. You know, they never tell you. But you, was the, you, you did therapy huh, yeah, for yeah. a minute. Yeah. And it, it, it helped. <laughs> he goes, it's perfect. I get a talk no, for no. an hour. <laughs> I was just, you know, <laughs> you know what I was just going to do for now? I was going to tell me, you know, Raymond, are you listening? Like, oh my God, look, good job, good job. No, yeah. Hey, Pops, he's listening. <laughs> I'm listening. I am. Save a little bit for Pops. Right? You know, but <laughs> no, por eso Pops digo, 
is gonna get the full for- force. <laughs> Pero este, yeah, and person si estás like some people like they're not ready in that moment. They're not gonna be ready ever yeah. because some people know. Because some people know what it will do to That's them. That's what I was going to ask. Are you ready? No. One, some people will know what it's going to do to them. Well, no, I, there's a lot of... Now there's a lot more layers to that onion. Wait, but yeah. Uh, y, y por eso digo, back then, whatever. Now as an adult, you're like, there's more layers to that situation that probably you didn't want to talk. Y por eso as you get older, you start realizing more shit and more shit and more yeah, shit. And then yeah. you're like, fuck, that's a lot of shit it to unpack. overwhelming, yeah. Ugh. And then pasa COVID, and then there's more oh fucking layers to the onion. Yeah. yeah, there was this one thing that I saw on the Instagram. Is this person there like, yeah, you know, I'm healing, and I already they're talking about healing, and they're like, oh yeah, I already did this part, but now that I did this part, this other thing came up, and now this other thing came up, and this other thing came up, and it's like, yep, it's a never ending cycle of healing. Yeah, you know, but some people get so stuck in that healing process that that's all that their life becomes about where it's like no you're not going to be able to heal everything not every fucking thing yeah. you're not going to be able to heal that little fucking five-year-old heartbreak well i mean you i mean it's like everything like from your mistakes and from traumas you learn no? yeah you learn and some of those things because you're not going to get rid of because you need them to, to yeah. survive shit yeah you know? yeah it's your heartbreak hey man <laughs> what can i say when was the last time you cried um Last week? Okay. I don't know. It's healthy, bro. Last yes. week. Acá really? mi bro no tiene pelos en la lengua. Más <laughs> chulo. <laughs> <laughs> no, yeah. What was it? Yeah. La- <laughs> okay, yeah. And yeah, last week. Okay. Shit, I was talking to you yeah. when I was crying. Yeah. Ah, so mm-hmm. she said, yeah, she was plan con maña. Yeah. Yeah. I probably wasn't listening. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm sure. <laughs> yeah, yeah, pero, pero digo, fuera de esa situación... Stress related cries. Oh, um, oh shit, that's a, shit. That's a whole other ball game. Yeah, man. that was like in February. Yeah. That's January, February. Yeah. Hmm? Yeah, she was just piling up. I was just yeah. like, eh, you know, it's entro el año nuevo. She's not going well. It's just yeah. like, Fuck, what you mm-hmm. said. Is that, that during yeah. that time that I was feeling stuff? I think I, so we, like we talked anxiety, about anxiety, like, yeah, yeah panic anxiety. Attack almost, yeah. And it's just like, everything's like, um, I'm like fucking me estoy ahogando type of yeah. thing. You know, that, that one was, that, that one was tough. Yeah, a veces después de la llorada te sientes un poco. No, 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 <laughs> no. I still got more tears. <laughs> yeah, I still have more. I got more thoughts. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I think, um, I think when it's like anxiety or, or like, um, helpless, helplessness, uh, hopelessness, hopelessness, help- hopelessness, sin esperanza, yeah. uh-huh. you know, okay. yeah, la falta de esperanza, pinche esperanza, donde andas cabrón, para que te haces derrogado, well, anyway. she's better than Veronica, no, yeah, yeah, that's true, yeah. <laughs> Especially the yeah. insurance. Esperanza no, is there for sure. I know. That's why I've never gone to Veronica's insurance. Don't trust her. <laughs> Don't Veronica break my heart in her sad eyes. I know. Um, yeah, it's just like you. I don't know. That one. Yeah, you cry it out and everything. And you think you might feel better. But after the cry, it's like, okay, I need to. Something needs to happen. Mm. As in another one where like if it's sadness or whatever. Yeah, you cry it out. And maybe at that moment. You might have a little yeah. sense of relief, but then it's like, okay, now I got to rebuild from here, mm. you know, because maybe, you know, if it's a loss or if it's, you know, a, a relationship, you know, especially when it's a loss, mm-hmm. you know, you're like, oh my God, you know, you cry, you let it out. And then just, you know, you, there's not much you can do after that, you know, because the loss is a, is a loss. Yeah. But when it's something else, if it's financial, if it's career, if it's, you know, personal growth or lo que sea, yeah, you're crying. But then it's just like, okay, fuck, nothing's changing. Mm-hmm. You know, I, there's there's still more to do. So there's not that sense of relief until you start accomplishing or mm-hmm. moving forward. Okay. You know, now I'm like, okay, now I'm like, all right, cool. But yeah, no, it's just all kinds of shit happens. You know, yeah, mm-hmm. April was not a good month. Okay. Yeah. April, yeah. motion, last it, month. Yeah. April was not a good month, but you know, ya comenzó mayo es otra cosa. I got birthday wishes. No, no, no. Empezó bien. I got birthday wishes, so thank you to everybody. No te llegaron los sobrecitos de lana. Eso sí, no, no, nunca llegan. It's thoughts and prayers, bro. No, thoughts and prayers. Fuck, thoughts and prayers, bro. You know what, though, prayers. La verga con tus thoughts and prayers. 
<laughs> but what about my, my la verga con tus thoughts? You know, but yeah, I got thoughts. <laughs> that should be a show. I huh? got thoughts I in either. different areas. <laughs> I got thoughts. Fernie, I have thoughts. Nah, do Fernie? Okay. Do yours? What's yours? the question? Yeah, when I'm in my little fucking solitude, okay. yeah. So okay. I woke up see. También, I mean, I got shit. I'm still trying to process ways I've been. Yeah. From fucking losses, way. Pero. Yeah. And then the thing is, too, a veces lo que pasa es que there's things that probably happen to us as kids that you're like, oh, I don't really no, no, You really never think it thought it happened. But some new thing will trigger that you're like, what the fuck? Like, oh, my God, I went through this shit. Like, I'm, one of the things I don't know if you know, for any, um, the the accident we had in when we yeah. were like kids. Yeah. In we, Mexico, 90, 1990. 1990. Uh, personal story, whatever. But we were in a ve vehicular accident in Mexico where our van flipped. Oh, shit. On the road, yeah, we got hit down by a the, down the hill. Uh, an embankment. The point is that we could have died. <laughs> yeah. And yeah, we we did some mean battle metas. It was a very, uh, well, I mean, I still like, ugh. But heartbreak. But heartbreak. It wasn't until when my cousin came over, Handy from Mexico, yeah. five years ago. Uh, it was uh, twenty eighteen. Twenty eighteen. Yeah. Our accident was in 1990. That accident was, we, there's a lot of shit that happened. We flipped over. We f we found a way to get transported to our to our destination. When we arrived to our destination in Mexico, nos recibió mi tía, my grandma. And we, I was 10. We were I was 15, 13, 14. 13, 14. Uh, you know? Yeah. <laughs> but I remember when we, our family was waiting for them, my grandma started crying. My tía started crying. In my head, I'm like, we're okay though. Like, why are they crying? Why are they crying? Yeah. I know. And that's that fucking accident, that situation, never got talked about. No. Never got talked about until 2018 when my cousin from Mexico came well, to visit. Well, I, I don't mean to stop you there, but... Are you listening? No, no. <laughs> the thing is that it never talked. My mom and I would talk about it, mm. but you and my dad would shut us up. Ooh. You know, and, and that's the thing. And I don't remember that. You yeah. stopped this healing, whenever bro. We, no, no. <laughs> whenever we would talk about it and everything, because my mom and I would talk about it, my dad like, ah, no, no quiero eso. You're like, yeah, no, I'm a no hable de eso or no hablen de eso. Maybe. I mean, yeah. if I was so 10, then, 11. So then my mom and I, we always talked about it, you know. Mm. And I think it's because gotcha. the way. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, the, the I I know why if, if that did happen to kids. And no, I'm going to because. When it happened, I remember I was in the middle row and I saw when we were going to get hit, yeah, like, hit on. And I got up and I'm like, I just remember like. This is how we And die. I don't remember what I thought. I just know something's coming at it. And I just remember my dad did what he had to do. We flipped over. Pero me acuerdo like, fuck, we're going to. Por eso arrebasar. Like when we. ¿Cómo se dice yeah, en inglés? Uh, pass, when so, you pass so, lanes. So yeah. woo, I'm like, <sighs> I get anxious with that. Yeah. But. I was never able to process that situation until my cousin came over one time. We were talking about it and me desembuché. I was just like, <laughs> and my mom's like, oh, yeah. all that trauma came out. Yeah. All of it because shit. it's like, oh shit, like we could have died. Like it was bad. Like we flipped the fuck over like five times in the van. Windows busted. And yeah. my little yeah. brother. In the 90s in Mexico, no seatbelts. My little brother, <laughs> we couldn't find him. Oh, shit. And he was wrapped in blankets. Yeah. And then the accident happens and it's our, it's right away like fight or flight mode. Get the fuck up. Get shit because people are, little cabecitas are popping Apart out from, from the, the hills. From the woods. The like, hills there have was, <laughs> There was like shit. a, like, so there was like a little embankment and there was a field and then over there was like a little tree line or like a brush y luego el pueblo, Yeah. Or whatever it was. El, yeah. So then um, that happened. We get out. I remember smoke coming out of the <laughs> yeah. engine. And I we remember were turned yeah. over. I think it was on the no, side. No, we landed straight up. Oh yeah, doo, doo, doo. yeah. So <laughs> when we went, so what happened? <laughs> it, it was it was Chino, foggy. Yeah. My dad, uh, el trailer de enfrente le dio el pase a mi dad. My dad's going. We're, we're passing. No, Raymond, no. he did not. He All did right. not. Well, I remember the turn signal. Stories. That's why the fucking semi was here. We're behind. My dad le quiso rebasar y él le pisó para no dejarlo. Yeah. So the that's what I'm saying. Bags. Because normally they'll give you the the the, the signal, yeah. like the, the 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 turn signal. So we had seen that before. So when I saw that, I'm like, oh, let's not pass me that. That my dad took it. And then as we're and going, it was and then fog, yeah, heavy and then fog. The trailer fucking started stepping on it, and my dad's stepping on it. And I'm, I remember looking 
at the trailer. I'm like, why? Because you were in the back, yeah. the last boat row. Yeah, I'm van. looking. I'm like, why are we passing? And then up ahead, we just see a fucking a flash of lights in front of us. So my dad really gunned it because I remember we went. I went back. Like, oh, shit. And then as soon as he had a little clearance, he cuts in front of the trailer. The trailer clips us, sends us over the embankment. We flip over two times fall from the from front to back. And then we started rolling another three times. And I remember in the rolling, uh, I remember seeing my little brother because he was in the middle. There was a space between where Nolly was sitting and I was at. He was laying down. I remember trying to grab him because he was floating in the fucking yeah. air. Oh, shit. And I'm trying to grab him, and I can't. And he's just like slow motion. And I remember one of those that my head hits the side window, blows it out, and then I feel the the, the grass or the dirt like rub my face. Mm-hmm. Shit. Yeah. And I'm like, oh, shit. And, I'm, and at that point, I lost, I lost visual of my mm-hmm. brother. So when we land... I'm like looking, I'm trying to grab him. I'm like moving cobijas and I'm like, I'm yelling. I, I can't find, I can't find mm-hmm. them. I can't find them. Mm-hmm. And my mom starts screaming. Mm-hmm. And, yeah. yeah. And then finally, all of a sudden, I just, because estaba envuelto en las cobijas, I grab him by, by, by a leg and yeah. I'm like, oh, he's there. All right, yeah. cool. And then as soon as that happened, my mom's looking around, everybody okay? I'm like, yeah, yo tenía un pinche chipote. You I were, don't remember. Yeah, you, you were scraped. I mean, or tenías, and my dad and my mom, they had the seatbelts on still. I don't remember. They had seatbelts, so they did have seatbelts. I know, but you, you, you didn't. didn't. No, we didn't. We didn't. We didn't. We didn't. Yeah, it was, it was early in the morning. Yeah, it was like, yeah, like like six or seven in the morning. Yeah, and he, then um, and then my mom, she right away like, all right, let's start picking up the yeah. shit because we started seeing people coming out. Yeah. And then there was an accident where that happened. Fucking people started pile driving. Yeah. Uh, pile driving. <laughs> whoa. Whoa. There was a pile Gen- up. Sorry. Whoa. The, there was what a kind of gangbang was this? Wait, whoa. There was a pile up and They're shit. Pile driving each other. Yeah. No. You know, my girl, I don't remember that. Yeah. There was a pile up because I know that you were like still. Pues, yeah. Pues. You were still in shock and you were still crying. You and my dad were. So my mom told me like, okay, uh, Adrian's here. We got him out. We put them out. We went. We walked away from the truck because we don't know where the van. So then we started picking up. I went picking up stuff. She went mm-hmm. picking up stuff. She snapped my dad out of it. Fucking start bringing shit down. You know, put it put it all right here. And then um, before you knew it, within fi- fucking fifteen minutes, we had everything done. It seemed forever. Yeah. But by that time, I kept hearing the fucking car crashes because it was so foggy. I don't remember. <laughs> oh, 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 I don't remember oh, the saying. detail. Them pile driving each other. Yeah, right pile. <laughs> <laughs> there was a pile up, sorry. A Mexican bukkake. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Playing side stage at Coachella next year. <laughs> oh, God. Mexican bukkake. Oh, my God. Oh, oh shit. Pero, por eso digo, esa situación. I remember right now, I'm like, oh, my God. Pero, shit. Life, God, whatever it is, was protecting us. Even uh, when the fe- the highway patrol that yeah llegó, coincidentally, the people they were gonna call, no, they didn't carjack us <laughs> because <laughs> our cousin was a highway patrol oh. in another, probably in the, the next it was state, in the next state over, in the next state over. But the highway patrol que llegó al accidente knew my cousin. Oh, okay. Yeah, so my dad asked him. My oh, dad so name my dad, dropped. Right, yeah, my name, my dad name dropped. So I think it was in Espinal Sonora. I don't know. Yeah, we were in. Right that, away, what happened in, in Espinal Sonora? So, so then, I think my cousin was in Sinaloa or some or somewhere. And like, then, so it was right right away in the tri- into the the road trip to Mexico. Yeah, we were to just, Jalisco. Yeah. We were going to Jalisco. Yeah, yeah. yeah. and that was Sonora's December because we were going state. for Christmas. Yeah. So then from there, o sea, so esa situación. When we were talking about my cousin, I, all of those details, and I was just like, wow, like, damn, we never processed it. Well, Even though right now I'm like you talking didn't about. Process it, Ramon said he, for, he was trying for years. For years. <laughs> no, 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 no years, but we would bring it up occasionally because sometimes the, the talk would come up. Pero digo, when I say process, I'm talking about. What I what we felt oh. when the situation happened, we, yeah. My mom be like, "Well, you like seeing that?" I'm like, "I don't want to talk about it." Yeah. Porque whenever they would come, bring that up, I would see the lights. Yeah, I would see that fucking truck, and I remember like, que estaba yo acostada, and I just like, you sat up. I saw. It. I remember. I remember you sitting up because I saw the same thing. Because I'm looking. Yeah, and I'm like, we're not going. And then all of a sudden, I I look forward and uh, you know I see the lights. My mom makes a comment. And then you sit up, and then my dad guns it. Yeah. I'll, 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 when Mancha would bring it up, the things that would come up were seeing the, the, the semi the ahead of us and, and the sounds of my mom screaming, telling my dad, 
do yeah. and that's why I wouldn't want to talk about it because yeah. those were the things that I yeah, was the think gallon, of. yeah because it was it was it was it was like and then oh, yeah. the get up and get the stuff because people are popping up and getting those asalta aquí yeah. or whatever whatever and then getting to the next town it, it was just a mess so those are all the things I think about but when when my cousin was visiting we were able to talk about how it felt you know and yeah, you know, you said like, oh my god, like we. I told him like, well, we've never talked about it, like That's like this, that shit, yeah. Yeah. like this, because even my cousin was like, Mi tía nunca hemos hablado de eso, and how the desperation they felt. Yeah, because we were supposed to get there at a yeah. predetermined time, yeah. but um, yeah. So yeah. we were at the, the 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 van was unserviceable. It wasn't yeah. driving. It was a whole fucking and luckily a <laughs> whole family adventure. <laughs> a, a, a family took us in in the little town. Mm-hmm. And my dad, yeah, my dad worked out. I mean, even up to that, my dad kind of did some stuff, but with the guidance of my mom. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So finally, we we were able to transport the van from there to to Guadalajara. Mm-hmm. And when we got there, yeah, I remember when they opened the door, I, everybody was there. Yeah. My cousins. <laughs> no they shit. Opened, it was yeah, a semi. We, we were Bernie. in a in a transportation <laughs> vehicle. <laughs> they and, and put transporte. The, after the accident, they take us to a town. Some this is what life has whatever. My mom goes to a little a, a little office era, in the era la, era la, la, la oficina municipal. Whatever. Yeah. And she tells the girl there, the secretary, hey, can I borrow the phone? Whatever, whatever. We just got into an accident, blah, blah, blah. So the girl, yeah, it was a telephono. Of course she's ear hustling because my mom right there in the fucking conversation. And that girl right away is like, You guys, my family lives here. Like yeah, you just, guys could stay here. Yeah. Don't worry about Anything you could put your luggage and your stuff in the so that the, that girl and her family, you know, nos dio posada. They let us stay in their house for like two days before because they were still trying to figure out the logistics of so, how we we're gonna get there. Yeah, that happened that and, day, and then the next day, my dad takes off, and then he comes back. I think the next, the following day. Yeah, so it was two days. The details are not important. Oh my God, my, yeah. Yeah. Pero Ramon, you si the, meche. Pero did you process all that, Ramon, before before that pedo or no? Um, Before, like she's saying, no, your, your not cousin? like, not like, not like her. I mean, I process it in a way that, like, my, my, I guess my processing was different. No, well, I mean, everybody's yeah. process different. My, my process saying. was different, but it wasn't. I guess because I talked about it so much, it wasn't so. Mm. What I'm saying, maybe so that was new. your process. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Talking about it and bringing it up and telling other people the story, like, you know. No, I'm never. I don't. I I forget that it happens in time. Yeah. Well, I like, mean, but but that because you repressed it. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah I'm saying so, she she repressed it, but I as, 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 like you're yeah. saying, you you kept. Trying yeah, to I talk mean, about I know. It. See, they go, oh yeah, we had an accident, pero nunca salgo that's in the forefront. And yeah, because it was a traumatic situation, so much so that even up until college, I couldn't drive behind semis, mm. and I was going to cast the delay, and my schedule was at the same time where all of them were being fucking <laughs> going to the there. port. So I would be stuck and fuck, dude. It was yeah, you stuck. can't go in between semis. Huh? Now I can. Oh, yeah. oh, now I don't give a fuck. I mean, yeah. No, like like, a fuck pump. you, man. Pero de primero, it was like, I would like, oh my God. And the shaking, I'm like, bitch, this is what's going to get you in an accident, you know? Yeah. But I'm like, no, abuevo, va. Tú puedes, Noela, tú puedes, lánzate. For a long time. And that's why for a long time I was scared of driving in the freeways. Mm-hmm. You know? Oh, Pero... So now, and as an adult, it's like, fuck. Like, that shit did impact me. And I didn't realize how it did until I started talking about it. Yeah. Y por eso esa vez con mi mom, I was just like, and she's like, llora, mija, llora. And I'm like, I don't want to cry. I ain't no weak bitch. Llora, <laughs> mija, no. O sea, así suelta las cosas. And my cousin, too, oh, she shit. was crying. And I felt uncomfortable because I had never cried with my cousin, you know? Yeah. So it was just like, hey, we're processing a traumatic situation from childhood with my cousin who I've never processed shit with, except, you know, childhood stuff. He like, oh, prima, the fun stuff, the yeah. fun stuff. But this shit now as adults is like, fuck it impacted yeah. us. But so you go, now that I talk, it was a fucking bad accident. Yeah. Bad. Yeah. I mean, a lot of people were like, oh my God, you, because uh, in the pile up, <laughs> there was, where there everybody was, was, there was driving each other. Era, <laughs> era un pinche, un camión de, de transporte. It was like a, like a passenger bus. 
right? Well, they started crashing. <laughs> I don't remember that. And, and, and I but remember. But he was older. So yeah. yeah. And I remember, like, there was people coming out from a bus, bloody as hell, broken, like a broken I leg agree. and a broken arm or something. And there was older wow. ladies crying. And you, I remember seeing an older lady with, like, a broken nose Jeez. and shit like that. And, I mean, and then all it did is, like, it crashed into a, another trailer or something mm-hmm. in the back. Pero no quedó volteado ni nada. So they were able to get off. And they were like, and I remember getting, having them because as I'm picking up the stuff, I'm looking <coughs> and I'm seeing all this and I'm all like, shit. And then I look around with us and we only have scratches. We only have scratches. Yeah. They were like, you know, they didn't yeah. tore up. Yeah. Yeah. Didn't, yeah. It was awesome. <laughs> like, I think of like the sound. I, I'm yeah. thinking of it. Right? I can hear the fucking sound right now. And for us to not be hurt. Yeah. Yeah, está cabrón. Yeah, no, the, there, there the windows were busted out. Yeah. No, no, no. One of them was by Mamaceta. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I remember hitting Macetota, it hard. Wey, I remember hitting it hard. Uh-huh. And we're lucky is, his Maceta didn't I, cause more damage. No, and, and it's one of those <laughs> where I start thinking, am I like, by a foot difference or inches? Because I remember hitting it and I remember blowing it out because I saw it <laughs> fuck the, the, the window uh-huh. flying. And then I remember like landing hitting the grass and then I remember seeing the frame donde iba el, el, el espejo el vidrio uh-huh, uh-huh. I see that edge like right close to me so in my head would have I would have been crushed right it, there it, in the in the movie version though cuando va la cámara lenta and he hits the thing and it breaks <laughs> like they're gonna put a close up of his hand like <laughs> going along the grass <laughs> <laughs> like he's just touching like barely the touching the blade, blades yeah. the little blade to, to mother la laguita yeah. from yeah, the, dew. <laughs> the dew off the blades yeah. of grass yeah, because <laughs> or or they could focus into the little <laughs> droplet the dew on the on the blade of the glass of yeah. the grass and then uh, as you zoom in you can see my face coming towards <laughs> it <laughs> hello <laughs> you, you can see how close his face came to the blade of grass ahorita me acordé when we got there you know what they did I think nos desempacharon yeah Oh, the, the sure. but the, 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 the yeah. back, that was one of the first yeah. things Pulling that the skin in your back or yeah the, okay. uh, like, uh, doing the physical st- after the accident yeah when we were able to like no it's it's jalen en los pelos I don't know what is it yeah, that they it was did the cuero the cuero and he levanta las manos like to yeah. shake off all the the tension the tension but then it was like Rancho what about science. the yeah but then it was now it's not dope what about the other stuff? Like, mija, ¿cómo te sientes? Yeah. Like, I know you're scared. Nah. Stuff. No. Nah. No, it was all no. the physical aspects no, of it. No, because even too, and that's why I think too, like, in these situations, you, I don't know, for your parent, do you communicate to your children what is going on? Like, look, this is what happened. This is what we're doing we're, to try to get yeah, here. Yeah, somos diferentes. I mean, we're, we're I think we're not more evolved. What am I, I mean, we're smarter, but we're aware. Hope aware. We're, we're, we're more aware. I guess at least I, I think I would hope I am, you know? Yeah. Same thing. Like, I mean, not, not the same, but like, like I try to explain, like when, when my grandma passed away, like I try to explain it to them. Like, like, I, like I think they would kind of understand, which mm-hmm. I, I still think they didn't really grasp it. Yeah. They, they didn't, they didn't grasp the, the, the thing, but I try to explain it to them, you know, but same thing. So like shit like yeah. that, I would try, but yeah. I, I don't know how well I would do. Yeah. And then my thing too, like they're, my parents' goal was to get us to the destination, get us to where we have to yeah. go to be with the family. But Yeah, there was a lot of family involved from my dad's side and my mom's side yeah? when we got to Guadalajara. Yeah. I don't remember. My dad's family was not there. Huh? My dad's family was not yeah. there. Yeah. Neto. Stories. Who? Neto. Oh, I thought. Yeah, the, that there. family was there. Yeah. And yeah. they helped They helped also with the, yeah, they did. Yeah, with they the did. arrangement and everything. Yeah. I thought my tias in there. No, 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 no. Crazy yeah. bitches. <laughs> No, 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 no. That my on my dad's side of the family, you know, they were there to help out too. So it was just, you know, I remember all of that. But then I think a lot of it got overshadowed because that was during the Christmas time with the yo yo and the fucking the the Christmas letters. So and then only that, but then it was Las Fogatas in Mexico, you know. Yeah. So a lot of that I think overshadowed because we I remember that being one of the best Christmases. That everybody showed up because yeah. we were alive. <laughs> you know? One of the best so it was like a celebration, like, you guys made it. Yeah. We're all alive. We're yeah, safe. That, so. Because honestly, I don't know we were meant to. I mean, not everybody not meant to survive it, but I know we would have had some casualties. That would have been some. Yeah. Yeah. Wait, but. Well, well no, 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 no,
oxymoron del pinche best Christmas yeah. ever. Yeah. Pero también porque, like we, like we started saying, we, as, the, as raza, like we don't process it, we go, okay, sh, ya pasó, todo bien, ya te calamos, ya los, te calamos cueros. los cueros, you're good. Come pan, pat, para la bilis. Pat, pat on the go. back. Yeah. Vamos a, a seguirle la fiesta. Yeah. Yeah. Y después digo, a celebrar like, la vida. Yeah. Yeah. And I think, después de cuando I talked about it, and I remember saying, like, yeah, I just remember que está. When we got there, my grandma, my aunt were there, my grandma was crying. When I talked about it as an adult, oh, when I was talking, to, that's when I started crying because I'm like, oh. and now I understand that those tears of relief. You know? Yeah, not only that, but when they saw the van. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. I think that was my bad. I, yeah. yeah, when they saw the van, like you <laughs> guys, you guys survived like this that because it estaba aplastada. Yeah, like the the, the top. <laughs> oh my god, was, you're right. Yeah, like oh it, fuck the child, y'all. It was a chop top. Yeah, <laughs> it was yeah. a yeah, it was a chop top. And you know what? Too, I think what deviated from us even dwelling on the accident was the adventure of when we got the van into the semi yeah. and the road trip with the fucking the, the drivers the driver the, the guys that were yeah, <laughs> oh, shit. yeah. yeah. it was I, 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 semi. as long as there was another pal driver <laughs> no <laughs> it was it was it was one of those moving vans like those those uh but it was big yeah uh, where the van fit in there but we stuff. couldn't open the doors we remember we had to crawl into the missing windows yeah oh, shit. <laughs> into the van to sleep <laughs> Oh God! <laughs> but what I'm saying, it was an adventure too because yeah. oh, they, that's something. Thank goodness that the right people were in the right time yeah. to help us. Those guys, como le decían el, el otro, el Tarzan, Tarzan. Yeah. That wasn't the driver, huh? No, that was the guy that was in the back. Okay, the Tarzan. I was in the back. Pinche indigenous I mean, dude was amazing. Just he took yeah. care of us. Yeah. He took care of us, and I think I told him like I think I had a crush on him because he was just. That was your made, first heartbreak. No, nah, my first heartbreak was Indiana <laughs> Jones. I was. Pero nos cuidó, and I still. I didn't get any scars from the accident. I got a scar right here from like getting off of the semi. Yeah. Y que me raspó un pinche. <laughs> the, the lamina. A piece of metal like. <laughs> he casi le dio tetanus. Yeah. Yes. So that's why. She survives all this and tetanus got it. El Tarzan like, mija, mija. From the moving van. Or no, he was like, mija, tetanus. And I'm like, ah. <laughs> you know, yeah. I was 10. Y el, el, I remember him telling like, no, but te va a quedar una cicatriz en chingona. Oh I'm God. like, yeah. Fuck yeah. But the adventure of that yeah. was just... That was a yeah. It the was whole, a good time. That, that whole thing was an adventure. It was because we... <laughs> I remember that. Metieron la van, but there was still a little part where we could fucking yeah. be on top. So <laughs> I remember just like fucking climbing. And I'm like, damn. Yeah, we had no front window, no side windows. Oh. Um, it was dark. Yeah, yeah, it was dark, but, but I think that we had a light. But yeah. la familia came through, in other words. No, yeah. yeah, but but it's true. Like, you just pointed out, like, their shock of life. Oh, I'm saying that they came through the fucking... Oh, yeah. It sounds like yeah. like the whole story, like the little steps, the, yeah. the family came through. Yeah. yeah. That, to make... Oh, I can't believe No, 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 no. I'm good. I was just going to say fucking... To say, güey, aquí también, güey. We talk shit que el pinche... El, que estamos here and there, pero aquí el, la familia came through with the little spot también aquí. I'm not good at fucking... I'm not good at being a friend. I'm not good at being a family member. <laughs> I'm not good at a lot of things. Who, 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 Ramon or what? <laughs> no, no, because no, no, I'm no. saying he's, I'm not. I'm not good at communicating like with friends. Uh, Come on, like you guys say, oh, I text my. Sometimes I think like, oh, I should text this dude. Oh, I'll do it right now, and then I never do it. So like, like I, yeah. like, I haven't seen him. Way last I heard, fucking, like fucking, he was in whatever. It said divorce or some shit. Yeah. Oh, I should. I should text them. And then I never do. Yeah. That's hey, what I'm saying. Okay. Here, here's También. another one. Here's another one. Not to yeah. cut you off. But he's all like, oh, man, you know what? Maybe I should reach out to my cousin. I don't have his number. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's what I was getting to. So, so like familiares, mm -hmm. like, you know, fucking like you guys are talking, que, oh, mi, mi primo this and mi primo that. Half the time, I'm like, I know them. I kind of like, I know the face. I know the name. But like when you're talking about them, like in that moment, I'm like, Oh, I don't know if I know who that is, but then ya que lo veo at a party. Mm -hmm. But the same thing, like, like fucking, I don't have anybody's fucking number. I don't fucking, like most of the parties, like if they're like kid parties, I'll send my, my kids with like my mom or my sisters, mm -hmm. you know, like I'm not a good, I'm not a good friend. I'm not a good fuck familiar, like outside of my immediate family. So I'm horrible all that way. So I'm surprised that like, what I was getting to is get like the spot we're in, pues, del primo, my, the two primos hooked it up, way. And anytime I needed anything from those bottles, which is the one primo of the two of the, my two primos, I only have the number of one. 
<laughs> and that's because we've done other things, yeah. like other projects together. But also, like they hooked it up with the spot. But so, like uh, the asylum. I'll take this time after your your nice story. Que familia también les ayudó to say. Yeah. I don't think they listen tampoco. Pero gracias to los vatos porque el, they stepped up. They lend us uh, the little spot that we're at, you know. And so, and I mean, if they called me, I probably wouldn't answer it. So, <laughs> uh, so even more gracias, you know. Ah, uh, mira. Yeah. Come y eso que tienen it. este um, a music school. So you're, if you're in like LA, tienen they have a, a music school in Upland. I think it's it's called the Upland Music Academy, I think, and then they have the Glendora Music and I think it's a Glendora Music School or the Mu Glendora oh, sure. Music and Art School. Huh? Yeah, los, los primos oh, aquí. Okay. Uh -huh. So they, they they have two music schools. So if you have the if you want to learn fucking play guitar or fucking something, or you have a kid that wants to learn piano or guitar or some shit or drums, look them up, boy. Nice. Look them up. Bueno, pues, Fernie. Tell them Ramon sent you. <laughs> <laughs> well, with all that they won't, said, know, they won't know who that is, but yeah. it's all right. Como decía Jerry Springer, take care of yourselves and Andale. each other. You know? there's an, It doesn't hurt to check in with people, and it doesn't hurt to reach out. It doesn't. It doesn't hurt. No. And it doesn't hurt to say, hey, can you check up on me? Yeah, that too. You know? Like, ask for people to check up on you. That's Not like constantly, too. like, you know, get to I'm needy. Yeah, no, no, no. <laughs> hey, once in a while, like, if you don't hear from me for like, Fucking yeah. two months. <laughs> Check up on me. Yeah. Yeah. All right, pues. yeah. That makes sense, Ramon. Míralo. I'm no, no, no. I have no, thoughts. He doesn't, <laughs> he doesn't listen, but he has good thoughts. I have thoughts. I have thoughts for any. Uh, hey, before we go, I'm talking about taking care of each other. What happened with your neighbor? <laughs> Did she cut the branch? No. Still no. there? No. Right, no. Pues. no they, right. um, he yeah. just, she just wanted the update. <laughs> He's like, I haven't sat out for an hour outside. No, so I, I, don't I, know. I, I keep looking at the branch. The branch is still there. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, no, no, no. Ramon. Yeah. All right, All right well, thank you uh, guys. Well, wow, hold on, hold on. We got a, oh. we got things. Like, <laughs> we got things. Hey, Raza, thank you for listening. Thank you for the Patreon um uh support. Thank you for uh the support with our sponsors. Thank you for the comments, the shares. Um please review us. That helps the podcast a lot. Um share the podcast with people. If they're not fucking say right, you know. Put right there, like, hey, you got to follow this page. <laughs> look them up, boom, hit a follow. Oh, look, aquí está on Spotify, aquí está on Apple Music. Like, you got to listen to them. Set it up for them so that, you know, because it happens, like, oh, yeah, yeah, check it out. And then they forget. What was the name of the... Yeah, that's a Ramon move, yeah, the, the fucking, I can't disagree right now, I guess. The Harlem Shuffle? Was it the Harlem Shuffle? Or was I it the win. Shuffle? The Shuffle Madness? What? <laughs> the Pal Driver? Something yeah. yeah. <laughs> Something, uh, shuffling my feet. Oh, all right, shuffling. And then they listen to a different podcast, all right? So so just set it up for them, you know? No cuesta nada. Um, other than that, again, like I said, thank you for the support and the sponsors and everything. Uh, Fernie, you got anything? No, just fucking just throwing out the primos, way. All right. Thank Shout you to the, to the primos. primos. Nala, you got something? You're looking at your phone. I know. A lot of people are like, what you doing tonight, girl? Oh, all right. Cool. <laughs> Digging my nose and scratching my ass. <laughs> Self-care Saturday. All right. <laughs> All right, Raza. <laughs> All right, pues. Okay, Mother's Day is coming. Don't forget your jefita. Yes. And, and you know, for those that don't have our jefita, you know, just yeah, some jefitas. Some out mamacitas. There. There's some ladies that uh, some places that they have children but don't get visits. So yeah, maybe stop by do a little hey, service for them. We we live in a world where if you don't you don't have something, you can look online for one. Yeah. yeah. And you know, <laughs> support our vendors, street vendors, and they have flowers. Buy them from them. You know, yeah. florecitas. If you see those puestecitos de las doñas con sus little teddy bears. Puro like, sindicato. Puro, <laughs> <laughs> support your local some vendors. Shit right there, right? You know? Yeah. Yeah, some, I know. Some underground shit right there. <laughs> no, no, like, yeah. Really. yeah, yeah. But help them out. Support small businesses también, and um. Un chingo de gracias and Órale. a la próxima a ratos with that, eh? Tum, 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 tum. Ahora es que aquí espantan. Ay, güey. También aquí, güey. Yeah, pues, pues aquí for sure, güey. We're in the asylum, asylum, remember? Eh, eh. You forget already? Me están la... Me están la del pelo. A ratos with that, eh?